creatively created crochet with my awesome husband, Mr. Joe McLeod. We are here today, guys, and wanted to say hello to everybody. I uh, hope you guys are here and are having a great day. For those who are new, please hit that thumbs up. For those who are reoccurring, always coming back, hit that thumbs up and the subscribe button, guys. We truly appreciate you all for being here. We hope you are all having a great day or a great night. Sorry we are late, guys. We had to get some stuff set up. It's been a long day, but we got some stuff done. Hope you guys are enjoying your day. And please come on in um, and say hello. Please hit the thumbs up as you all come in. Let me go ahead and hit the comment because I always forget to do that. I don't know why I'm not getting a lot of light. Joseph, can you come over here and get my light set up over here? Because we are not. There's a lot of light. It's not coming up on here. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, Danny. Place. Danny's in the bin. Come light. get the light set up, please. I don't know why. I've been good, Danny. Everything is too high up on us. Yeah, I've been good. This light is in the wrong place anyways. I hope you can. I've been good. Hey, Christy. Hello, hello. Everybody, come on in. Hit the thumbs up. How are you guys doing? Okay, a little bit better, but I think these are just all. It's not on nothing. It's not on anything. I don't know why. Maybe drop down lower. Just because down. I was doing a video or something, yeah. probably. And there, I never got it uploaded yet. So, What's everybody doing? What are you all working on? What is going on? He said, where's my poncho? Yes, yeah, no poncho today. I'm doing my own poncho now, guys. I'm about to get ready to finish up my own poncho. I don't know. Yep, is that yeah. better? I don't know. Why is it so dark? Let me see. Hold on, guys. My camera might be my settings. There we go. That's what's wrong. Don't know why that was so low. Sorry, guys. Yeah, it's fine. It's back it up. Back it up. Back it up. Sorry, yeah, it's fine. It was mommy. Yeah, it was the phone. Sorry, the phone was acting. Thank y'all for hitting the thumbs up as you all come in. Okay. Shelly's here. That's so everybody love. Okay. We got... Jennifer's in the building. Hey, Jennifer, how you doing? Antonia's in the building. Hey, hey, hey. Yes. And you said school colors to a school color girl. That's what you're working on? What? So what school colors are you working on? I mean, what school colors do you have, Carla? I appreciate you for being here. I'm not sure if you've been here before, but I'm Dana. This is my husband, Joe. You might have been here lurking, which we all appreciate. So there's no problem with that. But I definitely want to greet you in the proper way. My school colors, high school colors were green, gold, and black. Yep, green, gold, and black. Okay, let's see. Let's see. How's everybody doing? Purple and gold. All right. That sounds amazing. Yes, Denny was just saying, Denny, where's your poncho? You know, many of you know, I always wear ponchos when I'm on these lives, guys. But just so happy me and hubby were talking, and he said, it's time for your own poncho. So... I'm actually right now working on that right now, but I'll show you that when I'm done with it, guys. So you guys can be excited about it. Coming up with my own pattern. You said this is for my son. He is in high school. Wow. So um, is he a senior or anything like that? Or, I mean, it really doesn't matter what grade he's in. But I don't know if he was doing it for like a senior, a senior gift or anything like that. Let's see. You said, hello, working on a dish top. Really, Helen? Hello. Welcome in. I'm Dan. This is my husband, Joe. I'm so happy to have you here. Thank you for hitting that thumbs up. So glad to have you here. Are you using some cotton on that dish towel? Well, I guess probably so, but um, what kind of cotton are you using, Helen, for your dish towel? Are you using a certain pattern? I'm so glad y'all are here. Okay, so Jennifer says, mine were maroon and white. Really? Yes, do we have, we got a, do we get a school with maroon and white? I want to yes, say. we do. Mission Walker High School here yes, in South Bend. Yes, yeah, I was thinking Here in Mission Walker, I think, here in South Bend. <laughs> hey, Lana, Lana's in the building. How are you doing? Thank y'all for coming in here the thumbs up. Okay, and you said, same squares, but I did finish the Flamingo. Did you? All right, Christy. Christy's on a roll, y'all. Christy has been just knocking out projects left and right. You said, we'll be, yes, we'll be this year. Wow, yes, our daughter will be a singer this year as well. We're super excited, kind of nervous a little bit because she's our oldest, and that means one step closer to college and out of the house and all that stuff. So it kind of gets me a little bit uh, teary-eyed sometimes when I think about it. Manda's in the building. She says, good evening, everyone. How y'all doing? We are doing great. Manda's here, babe. Hi, Manda. How are you doing? We no, are... she ain't behaving. Who? Who is behaving? You said, class of 2021. That's what I'm talking That's about. It. She gonna make my gipper come out of me. Hey, Nana and Whips, how are you doing? Thank you for coming here. I appreciate you being here. Okay, so Granny Square Mixed Colors. Really, it's going to be fun. Y'all are just doing a great job. He said, wait, I want to hear about your poncho pattern. So, Denny, I'm creating a poncho pattern, and you'll be seeing it shortly. 
once I get done with it, um, I'm just creating my own thing. And it's time for me to branch out and spread my butterfly wing. <laughs> so that's what I'm doing right now. I'm getting ready to start my own thing. And just so I can have my own poncho pattern to wear. Um, I do love ponchos. I love the way they I love the way they look on me. Um, I love making them in multiple colors. But it's just time. So this is gonna be my signature look. Uh, Chris, I am in the corner. I'm always in the corner. You see me? <laughs> I always gotta be in the corner. <laughs> Oh my goodness, yes. I had to put them in the corner where Atlantis today. I had to put them in the corner Atlantis, guys. Because, you know, if you were over Atlantis, which is just Froggit, he was getting kind of... I was being good. He was out of hand. I didn't say anything. So how was everybody's Mind weekend? That was good. They they tell the no, story on me. But how was y'all weekend? What did y'all do? Did anybody do anything for Father's Day? Um, Anything for the family? The weekend weather was pretty well here. Um, so we did have a good time with that. Um, but did you all do anything for your weekend? Um, yeah, most of y'all said what y'all working on. What are y'all drinking on over there? We got some coffee. This is a large glass tonight, guys. I got a feeling I will be needing multiple sips dealing with my buddy over here. Well, so I definitely have to... you got a buddy? <laughs> yeah, I, I got a buddy. Oh, yeah. Uh, this is a little closer than you think. Oh, yeah. He's a little he's a little closer than you think. You sitting on him? <laughs> no, no. Not sitting on him. He said Joe's Joe's acting a whole fool. Yes. Yes, Denny. Mm -hmm. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> and Nana says, How was your father's day, Joe? Uh, my father's day was good. I was gonna ask you how was yours, but it was good. You had a good father's day? Did you get any good gifts or anything? Or they didn't give me none. Nothing. Like I said, I will be holding on to no, this. No, I did. I got some really good gifts, guys. Really good gifts. I'm very. I was very, very blessed. I'm a money type of guy because I like to buy my own stuff. So I'm going to end up saving it. They told me not to save it for that, but I'm going to save it to help for our car. But yeah, I got some nice cash. But I'm happy because, you know, like I always told you guys. Man, I was full. Let me tell you why we talk about Okay, well, man, okay, well let me read everybody's comments Wait, and then we'll ooh. dive in. We'll dive into the full story, guys, in one small ooh, second. I was full yesterday. But let me just see if I missed anybody's comments. You don't want to miss this story, guys, so don't go anywhere. Okay, I'm just going to check in and make sure I didn't miss anybody's comments. But, guys, you're going to love the story. So I'm doing fine. I'll be with you all a little bit. Okay. All right, I know you got to get some rest and everything, and I know it's late. We came on later than we wanted to because we had to get set up, but I'm so glad that you are here. Just let me let you know that we are appreciative for being here. Okay, so went fishing Friday and beach day on Saturday and an amazing weekend. Spent Father's Day with my dad. Christy, that is amazing. I'm so glad you had a great time and had some fun with your dad. Like, that's amazing. Amazing, amazing. So Denisha, I say I see you're cutting up. I'm glad I came in. Wow. Thank you so much because um Joe, did you shave? That is what Denny's asking. Joe, did you shave? Yes, I did. Um, and you said okay, yes. Thank you, Monda, for coming in and kind of getting some regulation going on. Just because, you know, when it comes to Denny and Joe, both of them kind of act a little bit up. And uh when I say kinda, I mean a lot of. I am tired of making blue hats for the hat not hate, as I have already sent five boxes, which one had hundreds of hats in each box. What? One had 100 hats in each box, and now I am doing the last big box with probably 1,000 hats in it. Okay, well. Oh, that's awesome. Are you crocheting? You're knitting? I mean, what kind of hats are you making here? And are you doing multiple sizes? That's a lot. I'm so happy. Thank you for doing that, because that's a lot of work, and that's really awesome for you to do that. You said, I'm crocheting, so I won't be reading. Okay, you won't be reading? Okay, so yeah. Just listen, Nana. Uh, you don't have to do much reading. All you got to do is listen. This story is going to make you laugh. Um, just try not to drink as much because you will be spitting out a lot of drinks. So, listen. Nanas and whips. I went to church yesterday. Well, I go to church every Sunday. For those of you who know, we both ordained youth pastors. But the women yesterday cooked for the men. We love you, too. Listen, they cook for the men. I was full. I went full because I knew they chose to cook barbecue. We had burnt chicken. 
we had steak that tastes like lighter fluid. And we had potatoes that taste like dirt. My plate is sitting over here on the ground still from yesterday, right? And I opened up the plate, y'all, because I wanted to bring home. Matter of fact, let me see the plate. I'm going to show because I wanted to show y'all. Uh, and the plate, I opened up the plate today, and it smelled like trash. Hey, Rosemary. The, sm the, the plate smelt like trash. Do y'all hear what I said? It smelled like real trash, like from the trash can. Trash. Let me show y'all this. Look at this. And it smells like trash. What is it? Look at it. Can y'all see it? <coughs> Look at that. And it smells like trash. Like the potato, this right here. Look. Let me show you. This tastes like dirt out the ground. I know potatoes come from the ground, but this tastes like dirt. Like they took it and rubbed. Dirt was a seasoning. It was a dirt seasoning. That's what it was. It was a dirt seasoning. I figured it out. I'm fired. You see how hard that potato was? It hit the ground like, <laughs> look at that steak. Look at that. Look at that, y'all. I was cool. I only brought it here to show y'all. I didn't eat nothing. Y'all see all my meat on my plate. I think that's what happened with Manda. They just wrapped them things up, didn't they? Look. Look at this piece of chicken right here. Look. Look at that. All that char. You know that had been too nasty for your teeth. Look at that. Smell that. Chicken smell like wood. <laughs> oh my god. Woo wee. But I just wanted to show you all that plate. Cause I was full. I went there full. Yeah, that, that's from the barbecue Tasha. How you doing tonight? <laughs> but I was full. Oh my goodness. Look at everybody that's cracking up. Yo, Madison says she's laughing. Clumsy Mumsy is in the building. Hey, Clumsy Mumsy. said, oh, she looks so sad. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness, y'all. I was full. Oh, my goodness. Thank y'all for the thumbs up as y'all come in. Thank y'all, thank y'all, thank y'all. Jennifer says, yuck. <laughs> Rosemary said, it's horrible looking. <laughs> Good evening. How are you doing, Patricia? Welcome in. Thank you for the thumbs up. They're slowly going up. How are you doing? How are you doing? Hey, sis. Jenny, I'm Walker. telling you. I would not lie to you. Yes. Uh, I'm do with this. I'm not do about that. You said it looked like they were not washed. Yes, that's. I think that you said. I think that's what really happened. They were not washed. You said yes. Happy Father's Day. All right. Yes. 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 Happy Father's Day. You said that's nasty. You said my family wouldn't have eaten anything. <laughs> oh my goodness. You know Joe like his food a certain way. Oh my good Tasha. 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 You most definitely. You know this already. I'm probably under being to me too. Yeah. Okay. Let's see. And you said, hey, y'all, what y'all eating? I'm full too. You know what? Hey, sis Sharita, how are you doing? Thank y'all for hitting the thumbs up. I see they're slowly climbing. How y'all doing? Yes, 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 yes. <laughs> oh my goodness. Richard R. Walker, you're cracking up laughing. He said, Dana didn't you Dana, you didn't man the kitchen. What happened? Well, I don't get on the grill, so that's really what happened i don't get on the grill i don't choose to do things that i'm not good at i can't say i'm a griller and because uh, i'm not you know so i felt like we should have did something that we were all you know a little bit better at this was my idea from the beginning and it just happened to be where you know and then what even happened was we we're supposed to do everything there but people were doing it at their own house that's what happened i was full next time i go I'm going to have me a jug of 0% milk and some pops. I'm going to got to have them pops. I'm going to tell them I'm on a cereal diet. I am full. 
Hey, Kelly. Our niece Kelly's in the building. How are you? I got to check out your video. I didn't get to see your video today yet. Hi, Kelly. How are you? Um, we were doing a lot of um, getting stuff done. How to get patterns done. Um, I'm doing one right now. What else do we have to do? I had to do a lot of stuff today. I had to get paperwork done. I had to get this uh, playlist set up. I had a lot of stuff to do today, y'all. Okay, so you can't you can't eat everybody's pot. Ooh, we Manda, say that again. You definitely can't. Sister Dana, I take it you didn't do the cooking. <laughs> oh yeah, yep. I, I didn't do any of the cooking, guys. And um, it was kind of crazy because a lot of people were asking, "Oh, what did you cook?" And I was like, "Nothing." <laughs> I was like, "Nothing." And everybody's like, "Oh yeah, well." And they just walked out of the room. I'm not getting. I'm not eating anything. And I was just like, "Oopsie." And one of the mothers, uh, she said she was gonna try to go home and boil it. Um, yeah, I, it. yeah. So, I was talking to one of the mothers, the mothers of the church. Really, I love her to death. So she sit beside me. She go, baby, did you barbecue this meat? I said, no, that wasn't me, mother. No, that wasn't me. She said, I knew this. I knew that you didn't barbecue that meat, baby. I knew that you didn't barbecue that meat. That meat tough, baby. She said, I'm gonna try to go home and boil mine. I'm gonna boil mine so I can chew it. I cannot eat that meat because I can't chew it, baby. It, I can't chew it. I'm a boil mine. I said, yeah, mother, you should just do that, mother, because I... <gasps> mother, I'm full. Oh, my God, help me, please. Oh, my God, help me. I heard a beat without not saying a word. Oh, my goodness, I know. Joseph, you got to get those things fixed. I forgot. Yeah, I forgot. I did. I honestly did forget oh. about the, the, the batteries. We got them in there and I forgot because I know when you, I never told you to fix the batteries for the thing. You know that right there. Those. I forgot to tell you to put to fix those batteries in. Oh my goodness. I heard a oh said it's twenty three here. Need one more. Yes, one more. Thank you so much, sis natural way. We need one more, y'all. Say where did you where did you guy when you get that food? Oh, where'd you go? Where did we get that food from? Church. <laughs> it was from church. I'm full. Hey, Lene, how are you doing? Hello, everybody. Show some looks. It looked like they wrote everything in the charcoal. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Who said that? That was Jennifer. <laughs> oh, my goodness. I am working on a poncho, Rosemary. I'm working on my, uh, my own poncho pattern. Um, you know, like, like I said, I've always been wearing, you know, different ponchos, and now it's time for me to have my own. I do have one, but I want to want, make one that's a little easier. Um, and so it's coming out soon. I just, I'm going to wait for, wait to show you guys because I want you guys to see it. I'm telling y'all. I'm going to be getting these ear warmers done in a second. I got my, my just my stripe yarn, and I'm about to start cranking them on this uh, Centro machine. So we got some fun and crank up some stuff. I'm just letting everybody come on in and show some love. You said my hubby grills, not I. There you go, exactly. I, I don't, I don't tell anybody I can grill when I can't. I'm not gonna just, I'm not gonna admit that and say I can do it. I'm not gonna try it. Cause I'm up for a bit tonight. Twist it. Up. Just, oh, okay. You get your hair twisted up. All right, it's gonna be nice. Hello, Lorraine. Welcome in. How are you doing? You said, hey, okay. Hey, Darion. Welcome in. How are you doing? They got for the thumbs up. He said, sorry, I was writing all the playlist people down so I don't have to keep checking. Oh, I know, Lana. I always have to do that, too. I need to, I try to screenshot it so I can save it. But I need, that's what I need to do, too. You said, 0% and pops. His Uncle Joe was full at, for the Father's Day dinner. I was full, Kelly. I was past full. <laughs> Joe was so serious. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> Ah. I'm telling you, I was full. Mm -hmm. Y'all know when y'all pick that meat up in that charcoal, oh that goodness. lighter food hit your nose when it's back here, you know they done did some stuff. They done squirted some stuff from far away. They probably, when that fire went down, this. That he fire flamed up it. on there and then slid it up in the air and that meat said, Shh, and they gave it to us. He said that was, that's was exactly what they were going to do, too. I'm telling you, and I smelled it. I got to fix Atlanta, too. I don't know why. I, I don't know what I did. I'm full. I got to fix Atlanta. He said, Joe looking good. Looking good, Joe. All shaved. Yes. I had to get him shaved all up for Father's Day, guys. I had to do his hair and shave him all up for Father's Day. He said, oh, my goodness. The food wasn't... Mm -mm. Sister, you didn't know. Mm -mm. Nope. Hey, CJ Spicy. Hello. Welcome in. How are you? They got rid of the, you said laughing hard. Now each, that great church mother impression. Oh my goodness. Yes. I'm super behind the comments. Let me get through these comments. Sorry guys. I said mother done busted them out. That's how I would be. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Joe, stop. You're killing me. I can't wait to see it. Me too. 
Joe's crank, cracked. Oh, yeah, he's cranked up already. He definitely is, y'all. She said, Joe, what did mother say? <laughs> Joe, you must see Dana the grill. Yeah, he's gonna have to. Mary, hello, how you doing? Thank you for being here. I'm Dana the Smudgeman. Joe, I'm appreciating hey, you Mary, for being you here. Hey, Mary, welcome in. So happy that you're here. Thank you so much, y'all. I'm super behind on the comments. Let me go through these comments, y'all. Everybody show some love. Said, Joe, you eat your with your eyes first, and that food was an unappetizing as you get. Oh, yes. I didn't even taste it. He didn't even taste it. I tasted it for him. Um, he just he already knew he wasn't I going did, to. I was full. I did enjoy the roll. It was a nice, delicious uh, store bought roll that was very, very good. It was store bought. It wasn't nothing but. I know, but I'm just saying it was really good though. It was a really good roll. They cooked very that good. well. I should have asked for another one. You said that last Friday on the playlist is missing. The last, okay, yep, the last Friday. I gotta, figure, I gotta get that one in too. Okay, Jen's in the building. Hey, Jen, how are you doing? Long time no see. Holy Spirit, fall at Loday and Joe. First time you're live stream. So happy to be here. Hello, welcome in, Holy yeah, Spirit. How are you, Holy Spirit? Welcome in. We truly appreciate you being yes. here. How are you doing tonight? Yes, he says. You said my giveaway is over Tuesday night at midnight. What? Okay, so we never even got to get in that giveaway, so we got to enter that giveaway. I, everybody keeps telling me about giveaways, guys, and I keep from getting the enter. I don't know why. Yeah, none of the whip she is. <laughs> Woo! Don't want, don't. So when I see ugly food, I don't want it. <laughs> oh, Dana, you're brave. Oh, my goodness. Very brave. Mm -hmm. Ask her how her stomach was when she got home. That what you should ask her. Woo! Uh, my stomach was a little bit uh, on the churny side. <laughs> it was on the churny side, y'all. Look. Hey, Cousin Andy. I was full. <laughs> oh, my goodness. How are you doing, Cousin Andy? What you got going on over there? Everybody's coming in. Everybody's here. They're coming in super quick to say hi. Okay, guys, we miss you, too. You've been working and getting some stuff done. Super happy to see that you are doing so great. Loving everything that you're doing. Yeah, everybody shows some love. He said Brown Owl is having a giveaway. Really? Brown Owl is? He used to have a giveaway too. Well, everybody has giveaways, y'all. I don't know if everybody's in everybody's family, guys, but if everybody's got these giveaways going on, we should be a part of each other's family. That way we can be eligible. <laughs> eligible to be in these giveaways, y'all. Hey, Mr. Joe, we made a teriyaki chicken spicy and barbecue with coleslaw and sweet thanks, tea. Thanks, Comedy Monty. Mm. Thank you. Ah, oh, that sounds amazing. I had charcoal and lighter fluid for, for dinner yesterday. <laughs> help me. Please help me. Just help me. Anybody? Um, yeah. yeah. We had this. We had this. I, eat char I had a whole bottle of lighter fluid and char on my teeth. I had king's fur and king's fur too for dinner. Was it king's fur? It wasn't in king's fur. That was Spartan brand. <laughs> oh my gosh, that means I'm good tired. Looking for a new house. Oh, really? Looking for a new house? Wow, that sounds fun. Well, maybe fun. I mean, it's fun because you're going to get something new, but I know it can be kind of stressful trying to go through all those different steps, but I'm happy for you. He said, I'm going to do a live on Friday afternoon and announce the winner. Ooh, we, yes. All right. He said, You're so welcome, Sister Jane. Sister Jane's in the building. Oh, it's Holy Spirit fault. Yes, thank you. So I'm going to do a loud cast. I read that. Okay. Vivian's in the building. Hey, Vivian. Thank you for coming in. Thank you for that thumbs up. How are you doing tonight? Sitting up here working on this poncho. About to do some ear warmers. Have some fun with this uh, central machine like we did last week, y'all. I'm going to probably do it with this little whatever berry this is. Wild berry. Wild blueberry. And I got the cherry that I'm going to do, too. So don't forget to hit a thumbs up. Thank you, Nana and Whips. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Noni May is in the building. Hey, everybody, have no fear. Noni May is finally here. <laughs> hey, Noni May, what you got going on there? How you doing? <laughs> Loving every city says, Joe. <laughs> well, Auntie Danny, you can't just taste light for it. Your stomach was telling. Ooh, yes, it did. I'm telling you, that stuff, my stomach was swirling like a, um, what was it, like a tornado or something in there. This is Lana's giveaway, y'all. For anybody who wants to join her giveaway, if you're not in her family, make sure you hit the subscribe button, like button, and follow the rules to her giveaway, y'all, because she has a great giveaway going on. Yes. Everybody show some love. So thank you, sweet Denny. Yes, yes, yes. Yeah, I'm so happy that you are here as well. Yes. You're doing good. I'm so glad to hear that. How's Joe doing over there? 
You said your hair looks beautiful day now. I've just finished a C2C throw as well. Did you? Thank you so much for the love. I just threw something on, literally. <laughs> I just threw it on. He said, Danny, did you cook Brother Joe anything for Father's Day so he could not, so he could get the cold taste out? Um, no, I did not. I am going to be making something very soon. Um, something very like what he really wants. He wants greens and dressing. You can tell me everything else you want. Macaroni. Macaroni. And I can't think yet. Yeah, he has to figure out what exactly what he wants. And then I'm gonna put it together for him because that was my that's what I wanted. I told him from the beginning, I said, babe, I wanna make you something for Father's Day. We already know what the outcome is gonna be. And he was like, Well, I just wanna go to hang out. And I said, That's great. But we know what the outcome's gonna be and then, you know, it just happened. <laughs> it just happened. And uh, we kind of got a little bit, you know. <laughs> uh, we got a little, you know, caught up. And um, But the thing is, he told our leader from the beginning. So it wasn't anything he did it to be in a rude way. He didn't do it in a mean way. He told him from the beginning, he said, I won't be eating My this. My leaders know who I, know who I he am. He said, I will not be eating this. I cannot take anything. I'm fool. He said, I cannot eat anything with, that has to do with lighter food. I, that, I cannot do that. And he told him right away, so, you know, he said, I can't cook my own if it's possible. They said, no, don't cook your own. But, so he just waited, you know. He, we ate the cake. We did eat some cake. We ate some cake. I ate some cake, and it fell down to the bottom of my stomach like a anchor. That cake hit my stomach like an anchor, y'all. Look, it put me to sleep. I was like this. I couldn't wake up for three hours. That cake hit my stomach so bad. I was leaning back. I couldn't. I'm telling y'all, it put me. I, I was rolling around up here. My kids were trying to wake <laughs> me up. That cake knocked me out. Had my stomach hurt so bad. Oh my god, help me! I was just rolling on the couch trying to get comfortable. I couldn't get comfortable. Finally, I ended up going oh to the bathroom, god. staying there two hours, getting cake out <laughs> from a piece this big. I was in the bathroom two hours trying to get that anchor out of my belly. Help me. Oh my goodness. So Nani Mae, Noni Mae, she says, now I got my 2K giveaway video up too. Okay, so, wow. Noni Mae's got a video up, guys. So there's videos everywhere, y'all. We got giveaways everywhere that everybody can enter. It's super fun, y'all. So let a banana just pick my name. That'll be fair. Oh. That's it. All you have to do is pick my name. I'm Noni Mae's side dude, so I know I'm winning. Oh my goodness. Well, I'm definitely winning. Yeah, but that was, that was, uh, Denny was talking to Atlanta Banana. Oh. Oh no, I'm winning. Then you can't come on my channel begging. <laughs> then you get out of here begging on my channel. Look, Lana says, YouTube pickers picking. He said, Oh, don't you want some smothered turkey wings, Joe? With some stuffing, string beans? Who making that? <laughs> that's um that's cousin Angie. She says, Don't you want some smothered turkey wings, Joe? I'll take some. With some stuffing and string beans that sound good you said joe got me rolling oh my goodness this man is hilarious hey obw how are you doing tonight thank you for coming in here that thumbs up what you got going on over there you working on anything you said what have what what have i can into oh what can, have you came into oh my goodness yes okay for those who have not does not know what happened we went to a cookout yesterday it was for father's day I said my head hurts from laughing so much tonight oh my goodness yeah Man, it was a whole laughing night, wasn't it? So now, now, too nice to talk about people's cooking. Oh, not too nice to talk about people's cooking. Oh, Janina. How are you doing, Shanita? Did I say that already? I'm so glad that you're here. How have you been? It seems like I haven't talked to you in a while. Chit Chat Queen's in the building. Hey, Chit Chat Queen, how you doing tonight? Everybody showing some love. You said, about to dye some more yarn. All right, that's awesome. Yes. Okay, you said, hello, sister. Okay, everybody showing love. Yes, guys, we went to a Father's Day meal. For those who did not know, so I've been here five minutes and Joe already has me rolling. Went to a Father's Day meal. Did everybody get to see the meal? If you didn't get to see the actual meal, we'll let you know what it looks like if you are interested in seeing that meal. Do you do it all the way already? Oh, never mind. There's no I didn't know if you, I thought you said it over there. I didn't know you threw it away. Because I know people was coming in. I hope that There's only like in. 10 people when it, when it came in. Oh, so. sorry. No, you're fine, honey. I don't know if you want to show it or not. I am full. Let's see. Let's see. And yes, Chit Chat Queen says, Joe, I'm full. So, y'all, I'm so glad to hear that you're doing fine, Shanita. I'm sorry, guys. It really has a really horrible smell. Um, for some reason, our son, our youngest son, and our daughter couldn't smell it. They said they smelled nothing but fresh air. I don't know what kind of noses they have. 
But it's very, it's very uh, rancid. It smells like trash. It's very, very rancid. It makes my nose hurt. Okay. Very, very rancid. Okay. Um, uh, very, very rancid. This is the steak here. Um, and this is the chicken. Here goes some charred chicken. And here goes a little bit of the char. <coughs> okay. And it's a very rancid smell. Um, wish you guys could smell this right now. But anybody would like to have these, we could definitely send them in it overnight. What anybody like is overnight. There is a roll. I ate the first roll because it was very good, but I didn't eat the second one. There you go. And it does have a really rancid smell. As I'm talking, I'm holding my breath because I cannot smell that. Very, very rancid, guys. Just check we can say, Lord. <laughs> uh, now you can smell it? No. Oh, you can't. Smell it now. Go smell it. He sm said it smells good. He said, that is me. Oh, my goodness. The steak, Lord. <laughs> Ew, that looks like an autopsy. <laughs> I can't breathe. I can't breathe. Help me. Help me. Oh, that looks like an autopsy. <laughs> oh. oh, my goodness. <laughs> Look at Rachel Dawkins in 90. Oh my goodness. This thing looks like it has fur on it. I thought it had fur on it too. I it, I I, my daughter said hers had a bit of slime. Yeah, that's what my daughter said. She said, oh, I thought that was fat, but then I looked at it, it was a bit of slime. I don't know what it was. That's what my daughter said. She said, I didn't eat mine because it, it was slimy. She said, oh my. <laughs> that was nasty. Oh my goodness. I am full. Yes, yes, most definitely. I went for it, but next time I'm gonna be I'm gonna be good and I'm gonna take me a nice zero percent milk mm -hmm. and some cereal inside the cooler so I can make sure I have a bit to bite on. Hey Chelsea Love. The steak that we had yesterday. Um they got written the thumbs up. Three more thumbs, guys, three more thumbs. Um the steak that we had yesterday had fur on it. Well, it looked like it had fur on it, but it was slimy. It definitely was slimy, and um, yeah. Thank you for the thumbs. Like I said, then we met. Then he, okay. Then we he meet wasn't Fred. Denny, I don't care if no church members on here. You know I don't care, and it's not that I don't care. I told them, I'm full. They know. Only church member I have on here, and she's affiliated with us, is. Sister Rachel Joe Walker, and she goes to the church in Hammond, Louisiana. We have the same apostle. Mm -hmm. Yep. And the thing is, uh, we're just, like we said, we usually do all the cooking. So if we don't do the cooking, we're just going to do some looking because we're not going to be doing any eating. He said, where did you go? Where did you go to dinner at? Toxic waste dumpster behind the <laughs> county hospital? <laughs> <laughs> this is not me. Like, <laughs> not me said that. <laughs> I'm full. You said church food's supposed to be good. That make my stomach hurt. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's exactly what we were feeling too. You said, "Where did you get the steak from?" Yeah, it was church. He said the meat wasn't fresh. Yeah, I don't think the meat was fresh. Yeah, I don't think it was either. You know, I think somebody was doing some little. You know, I don't know what was going on because that meat was. It didn't look fresh. It really didn't. <laughs> Nobody in church and cook. Three, four. We don't got none of them little old woman that got the fat meat under their arm. Mm -mm. We don't got none of them. Yeah, because you know about that woman with the fat meat under her arm. I'm the only one there that has that. Yeah, and she's the only one. Who... I'm the male with the fat meat. And so we do the cooking, guys. I'm full. <laughs> she just went said, let me look old. He said, my hubby is funny about eating other people's food, so we usually do all the cooking, or he's not eating it. My fam be tearing up our food. Yeah, same way here. They eat up all our food, too. I mean, but we, we like to cook. We got to do it. He said, Lord have mercy. Stop praying now, and don't stop praying till the rapture comes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, help me. Help me, help me, help me. He said, how can someone serve steak like that? Were you wanting you to? <laughs> they were they wanting you to eat or eat it or cook it? Wow. Well, I mean they're supposed to be cooking for all the dads. They're supposed to be cooking for all the fathers. 
And so, you know. Which, this is the thing, though. I totally appreciate the effort. Mm -hmm. But my stomach wouldn't have liked that lighter food and charcoal. So I figured, you know, that's not a part of my diet. Mm -hmm. I try to stick, keep lighter food and charcoal out of my diet. Mm -hmm. out, of, out of this, um, what you call it, babe? The uh, Abdomen? Yeah, or even my bloodstream. <laughs> I think that that wouldn't work for my blood <laughs> Oh my goodness, but and what is the crazy thing is because like why did we have to barbecue? Why couldn't it just been like some catered chicken, some baked chicken, or why did it have to be anything barbecue? Who nobody? Yep, since Red Joe, Joe Walker, I could be starving. If you had ate that, you'd have been full too. Mm. I promise you'd have been full. Yeah, y'all. She, we have the same apostle. So my dad never ate anyone's cooking or went out to eat. I'm telling you. Only my mom's cooking. I mean, yeah. Sometimes you got you got to protect your stomachs these days. I'm telling you, it just yeah. me, I had to save it for y'all because this is. Ooh. I'm telling y'all. He said, "Yes, I'm funny about eating out. I will do chipotles though, but since this crazy mess happened, Tubby won't eat, eat nothing out. Exactly. You gotta be careful, y'all. But I'm telling you, I just don't understand why we couldn't just do some really simple items. It could have been very, very simple. It didn't have to be anything hard. It did not. It could have been very I'm super simple. You, I'm telling y'all, if y'all had to sit down by mother, by one of our mothers, y'all yeah, well, would have died. Yes, yeah, she. And I sat down beside her, and she was like, "Baby, you cook this." I said, "No, I'm cook this. <laughs> no, I could tell you didn't cook this, baby." She said, "It's tough." I said, oh, "Okay, so I'm gonna try to take mine home and boil it." <laughs> oh, help me. She's just trying to boil that flavor out of there and get oh, it tender. Help me. She didn't like that flavor, so she was going to take it home and try to boil it out. She said, do you have, oh, CJ says, do you have the, the count of the number of people that went to the ER? No, I don't. <laughs> I don't know. Hey, y'all, but the, I'm telling y'all, the potatoes taste like dirt. Yep. Guys, I, I was like, okay, I went through the steak, tasted it, lighter fluid, and charry. So the chicken, I didn't even taste it. I didn't even try it. I'm going to be honest. Didn't try the chicken. Went to the potato. I ate a little bit of salad. So salad is nothing but lettuce. Cool. Salad wasn't too bad. He doesn't eat salad. Unless it's just lettuce only. Then one had all different kinds of vegetables. So he didn't want that. Oh, they so, got that hard potato on the ground. We're going to get it up. <laughs> right there. So, I'm like, where that? The, that potato bounced off the ground? And so I went to the potato. Y'all broke it down with a little butter, salt, and pepper. Broke it down, dip, dipped in there, right? Next thing you know, it tasted like nothing but butter dirt. I said, wow, it must have been a really bad cheap potato or it wasn't washed one or two. He said, you put, I said, we put you guys on TV so both can watch and listen. Oh, my goodness. Thank you so much, Lana. Everybody laughed. and said, don't blame him, Okoti. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Woo! Thank you so much, sis Jeannie. Hello, hello. Welcome in. Thank you so much for the love. He said, God bless you and your family. Oh, thank you so thank much, you sis Jeannie. Thank you so Jeannie. much, Jeannie. Thank you, thank you, thank you. How are you doing tonight? We appreciate you for being here, and thank you very much for everything. You are just super sweet. I don't know if everybody's a part of Sis Jenny's family, y'all. I hope y'all are, because she's super sweet, y'all. Go ahead and be a part of her family, y'all, um, and check out all the things that she's been making. Have you been making anything new, Sis Jenny? Today we'll have to have that catered. Yes, why not be catered? Why not have something really catered and easy to make up? You know, I, I don't know where barbecuing came in at. No one ever said, I, I can barbecue. Except this guy. He's the only one that ever said I'm the only one who ever barbecued at the church. I don't I didn't understand that one. Mm, mm, mm. So I'm full. Hey Charlie B, welcome in. How you doing tonight? Thank you for that thumbs up. He said, Oh, natural way, Coach T, you would not do my Chipotle. They have closed three times because they don't pass health department. Oh Lord. <laughs> ha ha. Don't trust food out here. Oh we yes, see I'm saying? Like you have to know. Like like you if you like you think certain foods are good. <laughs> Until you meet a friend who works there, and when they get fired from the place, then they start telling all the secrets. There's one girl that was working at one of the Wendy's. When she got fired, she ended up going back in after she was fired and did live. And she was just talking to one of the other people that was there. And they were talking about how they didn't clean up the frosty machine, and how they didn't wipe down stuff, and how they dropped burgers and still put them up and fed people with them. And I was just like, oh. Hi, sweetie. Won't be going back there again. And you said, don't even, you said, don't even throw that plate out. Don't even throw that plate out to the alley. Dogs will get poisoned. Oh, my goodness. They will get, oh, my goodness. You know what? You're just hilarious, don't you, man? So this is church where you fellowship and eat wonderful food cooked by the members. I never know a church where no one can eat, cook, or bake. I never I never knew that either. Rosemary, that's exactly what I'm saying. It's, it's, it's rough. 
You know, it's very, very rough. And that's why we always volunteer to cook. We always volunteer to cook. Like, if people want to donate food and stuff to help us with it, sure. But we cook because it just, it makes it easier. It really does. You say, exactly, mine. That would have saved a lot of time and stomach pains. <laughs> Joe, keep sniffing it. Oh, my God. You, do, you keep sniffing it back? You got to figure out what the smell it's like is. It's so unique smell. Like hey, that. Zach. Zach says, bonjour, Joe and Dana. Bonjour, Zach. How are you doing tonight? You working? What you working on over there, Zach? He said, oh, they're out there. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Yeah, he said, that's like Valentine dinner. We had that happen lighter food steak. Did y'all? Oh, my goodness. Yeah, I'm not with the. I can't do those. I can't do those flavors. I can't do the lighter fluids. I just wonder what that smell is. I don't know what the smell. It's is like either. a, uh, uh, almost like a funky butt. It's like one, you know, like a funky butt, you know. Yeah, you gotta leave this man. Oh, this. Barbara's in that building, my girl Barbara. Hey, not saying this when you first came in. I'm sorry, but um, hello, welcome in. Appreciate you for being here, sweet tea. Hello. Love you, sweet tea. You said, wow. Happy you got the super chat. Thank you so much, Robert. I appreciate you. Barbara says, ew. <laughs> As I can't breathe, Joe, give me a minute to get my breath. Oh, my goodness, yes. Shonda's in the building. Hey, Shonda, how are you doing? Thank you for being here. I truly, truly appreciate you so much. You said, some Joe's fried chicken would have been. That my yes, exactly. But like you said, he, they didn't want any of the fathers to cook, but that chicken would have been. cooked. Yeah, he would have cooked. I, I the guy he I wanted to cook. cook. He was like, "Can I just cook? Can I just cook?" He said, "Let me just cook." It wasn't nothing but some chicken and steak. It wasn't took he would've, me he no would've, time. He said, can, I, "Can I please?" Cook? I promised the guy. He's like, "No, we want to cook for the fathers," and I had to be full. Mm -hmm. It's always like that, though. If we don't cook, we don't eat. I had to be full, and that's just not at churches. At a lot of places, so that's not. That's not. <laughs> he said, "Hey, my sweet Manda." Yeah, he said, "My mom." Always said, never complain when you're going through the drive-thru. They might spit in your food. Oh, oh yes, you got to be careful. You're so right. You said, we cook at our church, and when our guests come, they make sure we have their favorite dish and make sure we have everything that everyone wants. There you go. Exactly. Especially if you can cook it, too, because you can still make somebody's favorite dish, and if it's not made the right way, then, you know, but Vivian, I, I, think, I, I would love to come visit your church and try some food out. Is that wild beef? Really, hubby tried to tell me not to get Chipotle. My Chipotle has been so good, has been so good. So I decided to order the delivery. And you know, we have the ring. Oh, we have the ring camera. What happened? A girl came to our porch and left the food on the grill and didn't ring the doorbell or anything. Hubby made me throw it away. Food was cold, and she had could have gotten it, and she could have gotten into. Oh wow, so mad. Oh, yeah. He said, Joe, that's. That was some tangy lighter fluid. <laughs> ah, you said that lighter fluid has some butt rub. You in said, it. "Where you get the funky butt, Joe?" Oh, I'm telling you. <laughs> that was from church. You said, "Baha butt sniffer, Joe." He's <laughs> smelling <laughs> <laughs> it. He said, "My mom said I was an angel." Oh, your mom said you was an angel. That's good. Nana hands here. Nana hands here. Nana hands. I was full yesterday. I was full. My friends said the same thing about stuff. Really? Oh, we. So yeah, it worked. I worked at KFC in high school, and one employee spit in a customer's soda because he was so mean. Oh no. Oh no. Now the Zan's in the building. We love you. How you doing? We saved you and a piece of chicken. Yeah, you want some of this chicken? No, this is a thigh for you. It's Cajun. And some we got some steak for you too. Yeah. We got a nice little piece of steak for you too. <laughs> yes, man. <laughs> Don't you give me a napkin? Oh, yeah. That smell is like. Don't you give me a napkin? <laughs> oh, my goodness. Oh. You said, Who the ladies of the oh. church? Oh, oh, you said, Who? We the ladies of the church. You said, And I obviously didn't want the fathers to eat. Oh, my goodness. They ate, y'all. Yeah, and it was banging it. It was a lot of people banging it, though, y'all. It wasn't like it was no one eating. Yeah, it was a lot of people just knocking just it back, though. I was yeah. full. It was a lot of people knocking it back, y'all. You said, that's why if you go somewhere, take your cooking and only eat you from yours. Yep. That's how we usually do, sweet tea. We usually, seriously, we usually eat our own food. Because <laughs> we know. We can't eat everything. Hey, Callie, welcome in. How you doing? Thank you for the thumbs up. A few more thumbs, y'all. A few more thumbs, please. Sweet tea said, that's disgusting. <laughs> 
<laughs> oh my goodness. Oh yeah. It was a, the women in the church did the cooking for the fathers. Yeah, but maybe I wouldn't think about that. Maybe some of the women was mad at the husbands or something. Like, I'm <laughs> taking him out today. Oh, I never thought about that. <laughs> oh yeah. Oh, I didn't want to do it to church one day. No. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm just kidding, y'all. But seriously, I don't think I don't think Brennan was it. Oh, I think Jamie Pink Kelly. Oh my okay, god. Okay, exactly. Here I hear saying looks, looks like a tumor. <laughs> Where's the sauce, Joe? <laughs> what? We needed more than some sauce. That looked like a dead rat. Kelly, <laughs> Kelly, <laughs> uh, two more thumbs or three? Two more thumbs. Two more thumbs. You said who cooked it? The sister from the church? Yes. Yes, Nana Sands. Tumor, cyst, leprosy. <laughs> I know that was not me. That's not me. Yeah, that's not me. <laughs> He's like, you've been an angel where you're sleeping. Oh my goodness. He's not waiting on that steak to move. <laughs> oh, me. So, wait, do you guys have stinky meat right next to you? <laughs> And a fan is on too. We gotta get this, we gotta get this move because we, it's, we're, I'm just showing you it's a conversation piece for those who are new to coming in. Some people didn't want to see it, so we were just trying to make sure everybody got to see that. You said thigh. It kind of looks like a body part from 2,000 years ago, <laughs> <laughs> a mummy part. <laughs> oh my goodness, help me! Uh, that's, that's, so that's so creepy. That's so creepy, Dana. I said someone wanted to take all the men out. <laughs> <laughs> Oh. oh my god, some people just can't cook. <laughs> You're right, sweetie. You're right. right. You know, that's, that's what it was. Sounds like me and the women go, who goes to my church. <laughs> he said, if I can taste the lighter fluid, no way I'm eating it. Exactly. <laughs> and we can smell it too, though. Not even just eat, like smelling it. I mean, you can taste it. I mean, I mean, well, if you can taste it or smell it, you can smell it and taste it. I smelled it right away. So when I picked up the plate, I was like, nope. That food came from Ro Roadkill Cafe. Oh, man. Oh, Julie, hey, Julie, how you doing? Thank you for being here. We appreciate you so much. How are you doing tonight? Thank you for hitting that thumbs up. We got a few more thumbs, y'all. So then you look so beautiful yesterday. Oh, thank you so much. I'm done. I'm done. He said, sell that plate to science. <laughs> sell that plate to science. <laughs> oh, my goodness. So, Julie, what do you got going on? Are you working on anything? You making up anything? How was your Father's Day? He said, oh, my gosh. Y'all would have been collateral damage. Hit the <laughs> hit the shrapnel. Hit with the shrapnel, cause somebody want to take out their husband. <laughs> oh, <laughs> Kelly, <laughs> Kelly! Oh my goodness, y'all! He says secretly passed them some YouTube tutorials, maybe. Oh, <laughs> that would be good. <laughs> You're right. Oh, yeah, that would be good. Secretly. Yeah, hey, you see this video? <laughs> this one is good. <laughs> My favorite. <laughs> Ooh, he said, can you, you can't even give this to the dog. You can't. Yeah, you get the dog I bite. No the dog, dog, I bite. No dog, the dog sniffed at me. <laughs> he was crying all night. He was wondering what happened to that poor dog. <laughs> poor dog, wake up in the morning, poor dog. <laughs> <laughs> he think the dog had parvo. <laughs> <laughs> that poor dog be laying there in the morning. He was trying to wake him up. <laughs> Poor dog. Poor dog. They killed that poor puppy. They killed that poor puppy. Help me, please. Help me. In the world. What did the dog say? What did the dog say? They killed that poor puppy for no reason. That's so sad. I'll be too mad oh, they can get that food to my dog and kill it. I don't even care about dogs. Like, I don't like dogs like that, but I don't care about them enough not to kill them because that's going to kill anybody. I bet you all oh, them men were sick this morning. You think they were sick? I bet you they were. I bet nobody made it to work. Everybody had a sick day. I got to check on my bishop. I just thought about that. I ain't seen him on Facebook today or nothing. I bet my bishop is. I gotta call my bishop and check on my bishop. I, man, my job to look out for him. I gotta make sure he all right in it. Hurt my bishop. I bet you that's crazy. Oh my god, help me. He said, Yeah, my 130 pound pit bull wouldn't eat that. Oh my goodness, help me. Dog be scared for life. 
So I just wanted to pop in before I go to bed. Okay, well, thank you so much. Julie said she want to pop in before you go to bed. And good night and happy Father's Day, Joe. Thank you so much, Julie. I appreciate that. Thank you. We love you, Julie. Sleep tight. Don't let the bed bugs bite. We love you. Hugs and kisses. Oh, my goodness. Everybody laughing. Lene said she's weak. Ah, oh, Jack Queen says I'm crying. Shoot me now. I can't breathe. Oh, <laughs> you might be dry. Oh, wait a minute. Look at your eyes looking all fly. Where are the pictures at? Oh, well, we put a couple pictures up on Facebook. We put a couple pictures on Facebook. I don't know if you saw them. Do you see them on there? You post pictures from Facebook? Yeah, I post pictures with you and kids. Oh, okay, yeah. Yes. Also, hold on, come bring it in. Bring it in. <sighs> bring it in. Mm, love you. Happy anniversary. Thank you, baby. Happy anniversary to you, too. Today, thank you so much. Today this is our anniversary officially now, guys. Yes, but tomorrow, guys, we're going to have a little anniversary game and fun tomorrow, guys. So that's going to be tomorrow. Or later today, sorry. You saying hi to everybody? Hi. Get your head in there. Say hello. Hi, everyone. That's JC on our six year old. Okay, let's see. I said, that is so jacked up. God, I don't like ugly. That's a sin and a shame. Just stick to the bread of life and the meat of the word. <laughs> That's what I need. You see, I snorted so loud. Both my dogs was hiding under my bed. <laughs> That's what, they would have been hiding no more if they had ate that food. Chit Chat Queen said, Bishop is down. <laughs> <laughs> I got to go check on my Oh, bishop. you got to check on him now. It's not on. a sick day. Oh, my goodness. Check the bishop, my guy. Yeah, check on him, please. Bishop had to run. Mm. I got to go check on the my bishop. The next gathering, if she volunteers to cook again, people will be screaming, no! Damn. <laughs> what's up there? I'm, I'm laughing so hard. My kids came in my room to check on me. <laughs> yes, this is Rachel Jock Walker. When you come to town, we come to visit, and we have any type of food. Don't you eat. And we'll, I tell you yeah, if we'll I tell cook. You, we'll tell you what we cook. I, we cook most of the time. I will let you know. Yeah. Don't you eat. I tell you what I cook. That's what most of the people in the church do. They always do. come to us and say They come up to it. They sit down to like, like my bishop's sister. We real tight. She's been knowing Mary since I was a little boy. She come up to me. She go, Jojo. Well, she called me. Everybody call me. Know me. Call me Jojo. Jojo. What, what that back there? Because he talk real fast. Jojo, what that, what, what's, that, what's going on back there? I said, what, what, what y'all cook? I said, uh, we ain't cook nothing. So then she went back there and got her plate. She called me over there. She said, come here. Jojo, what's this right here? This, this, this right here ain't even, this ain't gonna work. What is, what is this? And then she smelt it, and she jumped back real fast, <laughs> and she smelt it again. She jumped back real fast, so then she tried to dig in the potato, and she couldn't get in there. She was trying to <laughs> dig the meat out of the potato, and she couldn't get it out. Then she's like, she couldn't make it. It just didn't, never leave it. Oh my God, help me. Thank y'all so much for the love. Happy anniversary. Thank you so much. Happy. Madison says, hi, JCI. You said tomorrow, tomorrow. Hi, Madison. Sweet. She says, tomorrow, tomorrow. Happy best anniversary. Thank you so much, y'all. Y'all so sweet. Everybody showing some love. Everybody say, hey, look at that sweet boy. And everybody say, he's so handsome. Thank, Thank you. Thank y'all so much. Hey, Sandra, I didn't see you coming in. Hello. Welcome in. Thank you for being here. How you doing tonight? We are so happy to see y'all. He said, did, the, did you let the baby eating thing? Well, they, did the kids eat anything? Our little, our little son to eat. Did you have any stomach pain yesterday? Huh? Was, this, was the food okay yesterday? At church. <laughs> <laughs> if y'all haven't seen that reaction, this was his reaction. I said, was the food okay? He said. <laughs> I really like the potato. You did like the potato? Oh, yeah. The potato we had tastes like dirt. It, it tastes just like dirt. You didn't say some dirt? No. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you didn't eat any of the meats? No. You trying to eat the meat? I, uh, I ate all the meat. You did? Oh, yes, something went to her up. <laughs> you got an iron belly. <laughs> you got an iron belly. <laughs> Our oldest kids eat none of it. Check Queen said, y'all check the baby out. <laughs> we got, like, have you used the bathroom yet? Did you do number two yet? Yes. Did you do number two yet? Yeah, we used the bathroom. Yeah, did you do number two? Oh, yeah, yeah. They done <laughs> told my baby stomach up. My baby can't use the bathroom. <laughs> and gave him IBS. They done gave my baby ear to bile syndrome. <laughs> he always go like clockwork. Now he can't even go. Here's the hat, Crystal. Is your clothes dry from earlier tonight when I made... Oh, my goodness. Crystal's here? I know Crystal's here. Ooh, my shoes 
Hey, Crystal, if you ever see you come in. Hello, hello. He said, I want to do this just so I could breathe. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. Crystal, thank you for being here. How you doing tonight? Oh, my goodness. Oh, let me read everybody. Okay, I'm going I'm, to. Oh, the bishop is down, baby. You got chicken. <laughs> just read. Oh, the baby is stopped up. <laughs> I got to check my son out. I'm going to use the bathroom tomorrow. You let me know. Seriously. Because I'm going to give you something for your bowels and loosen them up. I'm for real. <laughs> Y'all that. I'm dead. I'm for real. Jay's for real. If you don't use the bathroom tomorrow, I'm going to give you something for your bowels. Loosen your bowels up a little bit. Like a little bit of a little bit of milk and magnesia or something to get that lighter fluid out of here. <laughs> like, I'm, like, I'm seeing, I'm trying to see it right now. I'm trying, to, I'm trying to get that milk and magnesium. I mean, that lighter fluid to flush through his bowel system. But that's right, what got him stopped up, them spoons. That's what it is. It's them, they got their bowel. Help me. Help me, please. I'm sorry, y'all. I'm so I know sorry. that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to wait a little bit, chit chat quick. I'm going to see, wait just a little bit. Mm -hmm. And see if that uh, that lighter fluid to flush through. You got to yeah. drink some water though, yeah. so you can get that stuff to flush out of your system. You ain't doodoo in two days. <laughs> Dang. You ain't doodoo you got for real. No, he ain't doodoo. That boy do like clockwork. He yeah, got good, good wow. system. You didn't use the bathroom for real. No, my baby. You didn't use the bathroom. You didn't use the bathroom. Use the bathroom. <laughs> <laughs> and you can't pee either? Lord, you can't pee or do them Because you got that lighter fluid in you, for real. <laughs> Y'all laughing, that's sad. It's 12 o'clock. You can't pee or do them? What's going on? I didn't get, get that lighter oh, fluid out of here. Oh, help me, Jesus. He can't use the bathroom at all. <laughs> oh, Lord, help me. Oh, and it's stop it for baby's kidneys. Lord, it's 12 can we see? Our baby ain't peeing or dookie? Go get some water. Come on, go ahead. I know, get some water for real, son, because that's crazy right there. <laughs> I haven't seen him doo-doo at all. So that lighter fluid to stop my baby up. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my gosh, help me. Oh my goodness. Smell a little water, Jay. Okay, so here. Not here. Because you're not used to eating lighter fluid like that. Oh, That's... she's not here. Oh my goodness. I was like, is Chris here? So I took a drink of water. I'm almost drowned. Oh Lord, help me. Oh, I hope no lights. I don't know when likes imagine near anyone who ate that. Oh Lord, I hope not either. Because you ain't you on you're not used to eating no lighter fluid. I don't use that. So that stuff yeah. might got him kind of stuffed up a little yeah. bit. No, they may say she good. She do do today. Did you? That's good. <laughs> I mean, he ain't do do today. We gotta uh, get him right. Uh, it's oh man, my hands still hurt. I'm gonna tell. Feel like I have a hangover tomorrow. Oh my goodness. You see, I'm trying to eat my Reese cup between laughing. Damn. Yeah, yeah drink some water, boy. Cause he uses the bathroom like clockwork. Yeah, he does. That's he, crazy. He goes like you' supposed to go. Like you know, you' supposed to go after every meal. He goes after every meal. He is good at that. Sure I, mean, I love it. I, want, I really want him to you stay like that for his whole life. Because that's horrible when you get stopped up and stuff. No, you're going to go to the car and get some water. Go to the sister and watch you. Go to the car and get some water. Oh, my goodness. You said, yeah. You said, Mike, spontaneous combust. Oh, my goodness. I hope not. <laughs> he said, he's not used to eating tainted meat. Oh, my God. You hear what Rosemary said? She said he's not used to eating tainted meat. No, oh, he ain't used to eating no tainted meat. That's that stuff right there that has that that comes from the pantry. You think that's what uh, some pantry meat? I don't know what that was. They're like one of those those roast. I mean, one of those loins from the meat market. That's what it looked like. Yeah. But the what you call that the uh. I don't know <laughs> like, get that meat out of him. Can we do it like a Heimlich? Mm -hmm. Oh, he ain't choking though. You don't but do that to It's gray. It's gray. It is gray and fuzzy. It's like gray, gray, gray. Mm -hmm. Like usually when I cook steak, it got like a brown, pretty color to yeah, it. Yeah, I don't know. Well, I got a steak out here. It's that soot. Look at all that soot right there. Look at that soot. Look at all those black soot marks. Look. All that soot. Yeah, look at that. All that soot. Yeah, it's from that lighter fluid. Oh, I thought that was a rub. No, that's soot. That's the that's the crunchy. That's crunchy you taste and soot. Oh, I see that. Show them in the camera. Like you see it? Yeah, that's it's soot. like charcoal. You can see all mm -hmm. the soot on the back. Like see? it fill it fill into the grill. I see those little char bits here. Like it fill in the grill. Oh wow. Mm hmm I can that's touch it. I'm trying to crochet on there. I got some napkins. Right he here. got me touching this poison. I said I got some napkins. It's homemade right. poison. And he said, give that meat out of him. Get strangled. Oh, <laughs> oh. So I'm reading these comments and laugh microphone and then you read them and I'm laughing all over again. Oh my goodness. You said the vials have to heat it up. You said the vials have heated up <clears throat> and a lighter fluid will blow it out. Lord, 
Angela's in the building. Hey, so just got here, but we'll watch the replay. Good night. Okay, Angela, love hugging kisses. Thank you for coming in. You said mystery meat cooked them. <laughs> Craig Craig Church ladies. <clears throat> He's not having so much fun with all these comments. I know these comments are hilarious. These comments are so hilarious, y'all. He said chit chat said vows. She's so traumatized. <laughs> 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 oh, oh my goodness, help me. You said, what you guys haven't thrown it away? What come, why come you guys haven't thrown it away? I don't, I don't understand why we haven't thrown it away. I just away. wanted to show y'all. We just want to have a conversation with y'all. You know I wanted to show y'all what was going on. Uh -huh, he said, Bob, mm -hmm. yeah. You tell the lights to come here? Uh -huh. Oh man, but yes, guys, it's, that's hilarious. I'm sorry. That was hilarious. But we knew it, though. We knew what was going to happen. But we, I was kind of being optimistic. Joe was kind of already, he knew what was going to happen, y'all. You know, I went over here with my sister, uh, the chick check queen on her uh, live. Go check her out, guys. Even now, when her family members already become one. Yes. But I talked about it. I and let it was, them know what it was going to be like before I got there. I knew that. Yeah. If y'all didn't even go to, if y'all haven't been over to chick check queens, go be a part of her family, y'all, and go watch her latest live video, y'all. We were there. We hung out with her over the weekend, <clears throat> and uh, it was a ball. Ooh, it's making my nose here is kind of tickle. <laughs> oh, man. Hey, Elaine, how you doing? He said, hey, Miss Annie, Mr. Joe. How y'all doing? Like, we were doing, doing so good. How you doing, Elaine? How you doing, Elaine? What you got going? How the baby's probably knocked out sleep, huh? How was your day, Elaine? He said, we've been laughing for an hour straight. Yes. He said, what did y'all end up eating? Well, when we got home. I ended up making my own steak. Yeah, Joe uh, made his own steak. Made a steak and potato for the family. We, uh... Cause my wife don't make don't grill don't, or nothing. Yeah, I don't grill anything. So, I, so she was mad at me because I did it on Father's Day. Yeah. But I really wanted to make some quick because we really sit up any, there. Yeah. And then she's gonna make like I said, she's gonna make a big meal for me. She knows already. I'm, I, I'm lining it up. That's why it's taking me long to think about it. Because mm -hmm. I want, like I said, I want chicken and dressing, mm -hmm. greens, macaroni and cheese. I probably want some spaghetti too. Mm-hmm. I'm not gonna make a bunch of everything, but we're gonna make enough. Yeah, like a little bit of pan of everything. I don't eat yams. I mean, I eat them, but mm. I don't eat them like a lot of them to say, oh, I want that as part of my meal. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, he don't eat them like that. Uh, I eat them, but I, like I said, my kids love he them. Make, and he makes a mean yam. Yeah, uh, do make a mean yam. I mean, I could cook basically anything, some things I don't eat. Uh, and I probably, I'm, I want some type of meat with it. I don't know yet. Yes. Are you sure welcome yet. to Jack Queen? No problem. You are welcome. You said Joe has a tick the nose. <laughs> I know that. that oh, she's that, sleeping right now? Oh, that's a good thing. I think that what's name makes my nose tick with that. A uh, lighter fluid makes my nose tick. Elijah! Is she asleep? I woke her up. Oh, oh she, she was asleep. asleep. What? Oh, well, you can go watch him. You can watch him, Jace. Go ahead, go ahead. Go ahead, All right, guys. So I'm about to work on these ear warmers right quick. I'm going to do an ear warmer. <clears throat> Y'all ain't excited about her, her poncho pad. Yeah. I, I messed up the poncho pattern, guys. I had to frog it, and then I'm starting back over again. So I thought I was gonna have it close to being done while I got on here, but I'm gonna surprise you guys with it. Night, night. Okay, good night, Carla. Hey, thank you for hanging out with us. We appreciate you guys. Good so how do you make your dressing? Oh, we make our dressing with cornbread, bell pepper, onion, celery, celery, um, chicken broth. Um, we we'll use sage. Yep. We we'll use sage. Pork and season. Yep. A little seasoned salt. Yep. And that's pretty much it. But you know, eggs and eggs. Yeah, put eggs. In yep. Eggs got to hold it together. Mhm. Mm and that's it. You just, I mean. Mhm. Mm whether or not. Yeah. Hey, Iris. Welcome in. Said, first time seeing you on live. Thank you for being here. I'm Dana. This is my husband Joe. Yeah. And we're just having a good time. I'm about to work on some ear warmers with some of this delicious Just My Strike by Lion Brand. You said, how did you said how don't let that steak's tail tickle your nose. Oh. <laughs> uh. That steak is something else. And you said, let's see, let's see. The nice, hey, okay. Everybody show some love. He said, that's how my mom made it hers. That's how she made it hers? Okay, yeah. I want to see a preview. You want to see a preview of the poncho? Oh, you got to wait. You got to wait for the poncho. You got to wait. You got to wait for the poncho. Just know you're going to love it, though. You're going to love it. I'm trying to do something special with the poncho when I release it. Because I want to do a top as well. Okay, let me see what I want to do. Because I want bacon now. I want st that's, that's random. Yeah. Zach, you love different looks. What was you eating the other night, Zach? Zach said, I'm up eating. 
And then you get done, put this over here too. Move this plate over. I'm gonna put this I'm gonna put this table. I'm gonna start cranking on this table right quick. When you get a chance, Joseph. So before I before I throw these plates away, do anybody want any? Oh yeah, see if anybody wants some of that. I'm gonna throw them away. I was just wondering, anybody want it? I got a nice plethora of food on here. I got, matter of fact, I got two of them. If anybody want these shipped, I can send them out as a, a gift to you. Um, I'm doing a giveaway for these plates. Oh, that is a good giveaway. Who wants that? Everybody gotta put their comments in a random in the comments below, and then we'll, uh, we'll enter your name. We'll um, do a giveaway for them right now. Yes. Everybody just put your name in. We'll draw random names. Anybody want to put your name on there? You said, you said, I, girl, you've been here before. Welcome back. Okay, you said, dude, uh, chicken, and do you guys come on Saturday and Sunday? Oh, no, Shanita, no Saturday and Sundays. We got to have a couple of days to get other stuff done and all that stuff. Practice our song for church and all that kind of stuff. So Next year, do breakfast for the fathers instead. Next year, I'm cooking for the fathers. <laughs> they can't cook breakfast either. We tried that. The eggs was green. The what ham was gray. Office, she might take it to the lab. The the eggs was green. The ham was gray. Y'all what? Why? Look. And the and the pastries was expired from a pantry. Y'all, why did they have green eggs? Why did they put them? They had we had green eggs and it wasn't no green, green eggs dye and green. in it. It was green not eggs and green, green dye in them. They didn't. They was too lazy to cook the eggs on the griddle or in the skillet. So they put the eggs inside of a crock pot and they turn green. Mm. I I just didn't understand it. So we get there at the breakfast and I didn't care. I was I'm not even on hospitality, y'all. Uh. Mm -mm. She is. I'm not. I'm not. But anything she has to do, I'm doing it. I help. Mm -hmm. And my wife had stuff to do that one day. She had orders to get done. So we had a breakfast for New Year's. Mm-hmm. And so, y'all, I probably cooked about, I want to say, 100 pounds of bacon. Maybe, I want to say maybe 200 sausage patties. Two to 300 sausage patties, at least. And 100 pounds of bacon. Mm -hmm. You heard what I said? I cooked 100 pounds of bacon. Mm -hmm. So, I let you know how long I was cooking it, how long it took me. Uh, I cooked that much bacon and sausage. Mm -hmm. All they had to do was make some eggs, mm -hmm. biscuits and gravy, some biscuits and gravy, and something else. Oh no, they potatoes! Did. Oh, you made potatoes. I made the potatoes. Mm -hmm. potatoes. I made. Let's see what I made. What I ended up making. What I ended up making like seventy pounds of potatoes and onions or something. Mm -hmm. I made like seventy pounds or eighty pounds of potatoes and onions or whatever. And it wasn't everything else is terrible. Yeah, it was. But at least I had sausage, potatoes, and onions, and uh. Mm mm. Maybe I'll see you at the cemetery. I'll meet you at the cemetery. Is that who does the buying? That's sad. Wow. Yeah. Sorry, fathers. Please eat at home before church. <laughs> anyway, I'm working on a Tunisian baby blanket right now. Oh, are you? Okay, yeah, everybody asking, they asking what everybody working on. Yeah, I'm about to work on some ear warmers right now. Yes, it's not sure. Cannot concentrate enough to work on anything. That happened. Oh my goodness. Beautiful pics, Dad. Yes, y'all was so king. Then I want to see you wearing your jewelry. Yes, you're going to see the picture tomorrow. I'm posting that picture for the anniversary because today is our anniversary officially now. So I'm post I'll save those pictures to, for to later today. Y'all going to love the pictures from today. I mean, from how we look. Oh, y'all going to love them. So I don't think it would be past. It will get past the postal service inspection. They have the bomb spot coming through the express. <laughs> <laughs> he said, "Denny, you'll be happy. To drink four of those water." Well, good job, Zach is drinking water, y'all. We're trying to get Zach to drink water. Denny has been on him, so yes, Denny is Zach's uh, adopted mama bird. She's been taking him under her wing, under her wing. And uh, yeah, Zach, that's good. Eat your bacon and eggs, Zach. You're gonna be all right. He said, "And take your own snacks." Yes, you're right. That's a lie. He's like, oh, no. Throw the whole plate away. <laughs> Where do you guys live? We live in South Indiana, about five minutes away from in, um, Notre Dame campus. Thank you, Danny. You said they make it so bad. Nobody wants to eat anything from there. I know they do. Make it bad. You said dress raw. Okay. 
Yes, yes, yes. I'm working on my cross stitch. Really, Charlie B. See, I think y'all better go just go to that church for the sermon. Forget them church dinners. <laughs> <laughs> That's what we do. That's exactly what we do, Noni Mag. It's I think how they do it. Don't know how they do it. My mom made scrambled eggs runny, brown, black, and crumbled. I did not know what it was or how she did it. No. <laughs> I, I don't know. You said what what about having Father's Day catered? Yes, exactly. Order food from a restaurant and have them deliver. Yes, exactly. That'd be good. But you know what's gonna happen? That'll be good, but you gotta be first come, first serve. Because they ain't gonna they're gonna spend about that much money. And it's gonna be about that much food on the table. And then by the time we get up here, it's gonna be gone. I'd rather cook it, y'all. I love Father's Day. Mm -hmm. I know it's a, I know y'all trying to cater to us, and mm -hmm. I appreciate that. But just let me cook it. Son, can you slide this back a little bit? I'm working on it. Uh, you're working on it. Huh? Let's do it, Mm-hmm. All right, you got that. Oh, I guess I did last time. I'm trying to figure out what did it. Mm-hmm. Just let me cook it, y'all. Mm-hmm. I have no problem with cooking. Yeah, I should. I'd have kept it simple. Oh, what did I do? Oops. What did I just do? I hit something. You accidentally deleted Chrissy's message. Oops, I'm sorry, Chrissy. You don't hide it. Happy anniversary. Sorry, Thank you so much, Chrissy. Joe accidentally deleted your message, but I see it. I'm hitting the phone. Yes, yes, mama in the hand. I'm four too. <laughs> Dr. Seuss breakfast. Oh, yes, it was. Dr. Seuss. Thank you. Okay, let me see what everybody's going. You fool. Yes, yes, yes. You say, oh, yeah. How, how, how are you working on tonight? Okay, anything new? Any joke? Hope no one from your church is watching. Oh, <laughs> Max, and, okay. Hey, how you doing, Our Journey? How you been? Long time no see. I'm glad you're here. It's been a long time. So, Joe, you accidentally hit someone that wish you ever. I know he accidentally hit Christie's message on the accident. So I'm about to work on some uh, ear warmer, guys. Have a little fun. I'm just kind of curious to see how this is going to work. Nobody did because I was grabbing my. Oops. How did I do this? I got to lock this in. Okay, there we go. Okay, guys. So I want to have some fun with this thing here. Not thing, but. Okay, here we go. I want to make a um, ear warmer, guys. Have some fun. Let's see. So I'm working on my baby C to C. Said Chrissy, hold up, honey. I think it was an accident. Oh yeah, it was an accident. Yeah, it was an accident, Chrissy. Sorry about that. Joe was holding on the phone and I dropped it and hit the hit yeah. your name. Sorry, Chrissy. As he was trying to grab it to pick it up, he accidentally. Mm -mm, I dropped the phone around. Oh, okay. I thought you he was holding it. Uh -huh. he held I was holding it and I dropped it out of my hand and I was trying to reach for it and grab it. I must have hit her name. Mm -hmm. Sorry, Chrissy. He said I'm having my Coca. You having Coca Cola? Okay. What color is your um C two C, Kelly? You say just frog when that sounds real. Chris, I got you, honey. Okay, you got. It. Okay, thank you. <laughs> okay, let me see. So I'm gonna try this. Up. I'm kind of curious to see what it's gonna work up to be. And then I got that one, and I got the um the cherry too. I don't know which one I should do first. I kind of want to do the cherry first. Who y'all think? Should I do this cherry first, or should I do this blueberry? Cherry or blueberry? Which one should I do, y'all? Cherry. You think you going with the cherry? I just want to see what it's gonna look like knitted. Okay, so it sounds like fun. Okay, let me see what everybody says. And he hates when I drink cola. Oh, does she? Oh, what are you crocheting? Who me? I'm gonna be making up this uh, ear warmer. I'm gonna make up a turban ear warmer. Okay, everybody saying cheers. Oops, and I just broke it on my hand. I shouldn't have done that. So everybody saying cheers. We got one cherry. Any other cherries in the building? Two cherries. We got two cherries. Okay, we got two cherries. Oh yeah, do you say cherry first? Anyway, what's my say cherry too? Okay, we got some cherry. Okay, Zach, you're an adult. You're an adult drinking cola hurts you, not me. Oh, he said, I, see, I need to see what this knitting machine and stuff is all about. Really, Chrissy? Yes. Be careful. You're going to love this knitting machine, Chrissy. It's really amazing. So I'm going with cherry, guys. Okay? I'm going with cherry. How did you get over here? Okay, so I'm going to show you how we do this on the knitting machine. Very fun. This is a cheaper one, guys, okay? I don't have the Addy, which is like a 200 close to $300 one. Not saying it's not good to get, but I just I just had to, you know. I knew I couldn't invest in that right at the time. I didn't want to buy other things. And um I said, you know what, let me get something that I can afford right now because I want to buy We bought a patty. You know, so I bought a Centro. It's called a Centro. This is what it looks like on the front. Centro. Like this. So that's what it looks like, guys. 
I'm gonna go ahead and thread it up. I got a video on how to thread it up, all that good stuff. I got tutorial videos on it, okay? Um, and so I got a tutorial video on. Uh, do I got a tutorial on how I make this? Who huh? says Barbara House said, do you publish your email? Hmm. Do you publish your email? Do I publish my email? What do you mean? Are you saying is my email available for people to see, or what are you saying? Okay, let's see what everybody's saying. Okay, let's see, let's see. Kelly said she sold it last night. Oh, yes. Oh, yeah. I'm sorry, Kelly. Yeah, you showed <laughs> Kelly showed it last night. I was there live last night. Kelly had a great live last night, too. How, how long were you on last night? We were on for a while. It was fun. That time went by fast, too. Yes, 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 yes. First time I've been able to crochet it. Really, Kelly? How are your hands and stuff feeling? Barbara Howe wants to send a pic. What are you doing? Oh, I want to send a pic. Oh. Oh, you're talking about my email. Oh, yeah. I got my You can send me an email. Where's my scissors? I need some scissors. I'm struggling over here. Jake, give me the scissors on the ottoman right there. The other, the other. All right, guys. So I'm just going to load this baby up real quick. Right here in the ottoman. See the scissors? Thank you, handsome young man. Thank you so much. But um, yeah, I got a video on how exactly how to do these different steps. You say she's asking me. Okay, Joe's putting it up there. Okay, my Michael's order was finally accepted. What? All right, Kelly, Ms. Ann, did you did your station just blank off a minute ago? No. No, I don't know what happened. Mm -hmm. so that looks like my ringer watch. But she ain't. I guess the, you know what? No, he makes it. Did your my husband? Yes, he does crochet, Iris. Yes, he crochets. He sure does. He does a great job, too. I'm trying to get him into doing more crochet. Um, but he does a little something. Let me see. Let me get right where I'm supposed to be at first before I start winding this in there. What number am I on? Oh. Okay, so let me get started on this guy. So we can have some fun with this turban ear warmer, y'all. We probably can get a couple of them done before we got out of here. If I can get it right. I'm going to get it right. I need to get it where I can put it. I really could get it where I'm putting it overhead, too. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. One day I'll probably do that. But I would like to look at people's faces. and Yeah, we need to look at people's faces. And then people can look at your face. Because you're making all the crazy looks. Who do? You know. I never make a crazy face. The first thing about this thing, guys, you gotta um, you gotta weave it in manually the first time you ever do it, and then after that you can just crank. But the first time you got to go through, you gotta do a manual weave in, guys. Okay, let's see what everybody's saying. Oh, you said you trying to get off soda? That's good. It says it's been raining, keep keep falling asleep, but I need to get this done. Yeah, I try to get this done, but you know. Lane said somebody's putting her time out constantly. What? No, don't go, Lane. What? I don't see you in time out, Miss Lane. Don't go. Don't go. We want you to be here. Nobody. Yeah. I, didn't, I didn't see no. I don't know who's putting Elaine in time out. Danny, did anybody put Elaine in time out? Any of our moderators, please let me know. Did anybody put? Yeah, don't hit, put Elaine in timeout. I don't see her in timeout though. Don't it show us? Yeah, I thought it would be but in time. I thought it would show us. Maybe because she said it went blank. Maybe come leave and come back again. You might have to leave and come back. We love you too, but you don't have to go. Yeah, I've seen all her comments too, Christy. Yeah, I can see all your comments, Elaine. Yeah. Oh, so that was payday on YouTube, was it? I can't wait to make it that day. You probably make your next month, probably. Totally. John Banks said that was who used their cars, and Michael always have issues. Really? I didn't know that. Did we ever? No, we didn't go to Michael's. We went to Joanne's. Never mind. I was like, did we just go to Michael's? Who's that today with Fred? Uh, no, no, yeah. And you said, my husband crochets too and does exquisite work. So, what do they do? They send it to you on your, um, What's it called? They send it to you like in your bank. Oh, you got to get all this the stuff shit up. The chat queen says show like our video ended on her end. What? Oh, that's why what they were saying. 
Um, on my end, it showed like her video ended. That's what that's what um Elaine was talking about. Mm -hmm. No. Oh, is she probably gone or is she gone? Wow, I did not want her to be gone. I don't know what Maybe like I said, might have glitch. Internet might have did I something the weird. Internet glitched the, the internet might have glitched because guess what happened? My son decided to get on the internet game and play with friends. That's what happened. And he knows better than to do that. You can't do that while we're on here. Yeah, game. he can't play this. This is going to take up too much internet. It's going to make us lag. Okay, I'm so sorry. Let me get into talking to some good friends like Iris. Iris says, who taught your husband to crochet? It just happened a few seconds ago. Mm -hmm. I was in my sister. But you just, the game is just beginning. It says zero to two. I know, but I just left. Okay. Anyways, I taught him how to crochet, Iris. Um, I used to teach free classes, and nobody used to come all the time. It would be like no one coming at all. Uh, I think it was because I was doing it on a Friday. Nobody wanted to come in on a Friday, so I ended up changing to Thursday. But I used to do them, and every week, no one would come in in the beginning. So I taught him how to do it. He was like, I'll, I'll, be, your first I'll be your first student. I taught him how to do it, and he started making stuff. He made a blanket so far, and he started a beanie. Um, he also loves to do beaded jewelry. He also loves to do clay, any type of ceramics as well. So they hold back your first month. And, oh, okay, you did tell me that. Okay, you did say that. You said they hold back your first month. Then the second month, you have an awesome check. Ooh, I can't wait. <laughs> you said I went out and came back in. Thank you so much. Wow, I feel so bad. I really want Elaine to be here. I sent up. I set up AdSense. They sent me to my bank. Okay, that sounds good. So I can do this. I got this. I'm trying to lose weight. Yeah, you can definitely do this, Zach. You got this, Zach. Hold on. You got this. So I'm going to do a video on how I set up my webcam all for overhead tutorials without having to tag tech equipment. Yeah, I have that too, but I just I wanted to put people here with me. I want to look at people unless I have a way to do two cameras or something, but I probably can't do that. I wanted to have, you know, because I, I did I did a tutorial like I did a video like that one day. Only way you could do that, but we do Streamyard. Well, I can have two cameras. Oh, okay. You can, you can go on a, on a different account and invite me in, invite you in on another camera. Oh, I can do that. Yeah, I can do that. That's yeah. what that uh, what's the name did. Um, OVW did for her. Uh, her, she uh, had one camera on her and then one on the stuff. Oh, yeah, I like that. I would like to do that. He says, fine here. Okay, so no, Elaine isn't in timeout. It would be so. Yeah, I don't even know if she's still here or not. I can't even tag her. If somebody's on a computer, they can tag her to see if she's still here. She might be gone. I'm not sure. So, wow, that's cool. I want to teach my husband to crochet, but he does not want to learn in a way that's good. So, we don't fix. Oh, we're going to fix for the yarn. So, we're going to fix it for the yarn. Yeah, my husband, he... He just kind of wanted to learn because I, you know, I needed somebody to teach. He doesn't really sit around crocheting all the time or anything. But if I want, to, if I want him to work on something, he'll do that. But for the most part, he doesn't really do a lot of crocheting or anything. Where's Snuggles? Oh, he's still. Is he in the video? Um, I can't see him. Let's see if I see him. Okay, can you see? You got your phone on there. Oh no. Okay, you can't get your phone. I'm doing a video. Okay, I seen that. So, let's see, Joe, what's up with your beanie? I know, he got to get back on a beanie. He started doing hooks, and um, I don't know where your hooks at. You want to show Iris your hooks? Iris, I want to show you your hooks that Joe has done. Oh, and Nanahan yeah. says, Cherry. Nanahan, if you hear me, you are. I mean, Nanahan, did you say that? Mm -hmm. Okay, yeah, top chat. That's what I was um, Nanahan, when you get this, fast forward, please. Or type it in there, man. Can you type Nanahan to fast forward? She's a little behind the fast forward. She accidentally rewound it. Because I use my laptop and my webcam at the same time. Yeah, see, that's what I want to do. But my laptop, that's going to suck up so much energy. A battery. What time? What I got? Okay, I don't so I don't want, okay, you so said, I don't want Kim to crochet. <laughs> he needs to stay outside in the yard with Jake and Oinkers. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Jake and Oinkers. Oh, my goodness. For those who don't know who Jake, Jake and Oinkers are, those are... Noni Mae's pig and turkey. Oh my goodness. Thank you so much. You're tagging her to see if she's still there. Okay. Luckily, lucky I don't see it by you, Noni. What'd you do? Oinkers and Jacob be in some grease. Oh okay. god. Did you hear that, Noni Mae? This man is hilarious. Orgers and Jake would be pork chops. Wow. And turkey wings. And legs and thighs. We have Orgers and Jake for Thanksgiving. 
Wow. We have sausage patties, mm -mm. rib tips. Wow, that all sounds good. Huh? Slabs of ribs. Mm. Sorry, guys, I got hungry. We're not talking about food. We haven't ate yet, so. All right, guys, so I have to do I have to do um, about five or six rows of a miscellaneous contrasting color, okay? That's how you always got to start it off because with this knitting machine, um, you have stitches that need to be binded off. With knitting, you got to bind on or cast on, bind off, whatever else. So you got to have some waste yarn. And I usually use uh, some type of color that I'm not using. I know I'm not using any blue. I'm using this cherry. So I've started to use this uh, blue as a waste yarn. So I'm going to show you a little bit more as I go. As you can see here, you can see a little bit of ridge around here. I did a few rows. So now I'm going to go ahead and add in my cherry. Okay? And I'm going to leave a little bit of a long tail so that way I can cinch it up. You always want to have a little tail to work with so you can cinch up your... I'm going to make an ear warmer, so... I'm, I was going to say beanie, but I'm not doing a beanie. And um, where am I going to put this at? I could set this down here, but I think I'm going to sit it right here. Since I don't got my tension guide, I got to order me another tension guide. I don't want to email me back about that either. Okay. So now I'm just going to put this in here, like I said before, guys. Once you get it all in, you're good. And uh, I'm just going to crank it. I have my stuff wound in, and I'm just going to crank this up. Let's see what everybody's saying. Okay, you caught up now? Okay, that's good. Barbara's back. Thank you so much. You just said, dude, shut your mouth. <laughs> I guess Oinkers had a, had a color and it on the cloth line, so Oinkers don't run off again. What? Oh, he had to have a color on it? Oh. Good night, Zach. Thank you for hanging out. Nana's hands is all caught up. I'm happy to hear that. Okay, so now I'm just going to go ahead and get my crank on. And uh, I like about the uh, Centro. You can use a lot of the Centro or the Addy tutorials. You can use a lot of those for the Centros. Uh, usually a lot of these knitting machines, you can kind of use the same instructions. So a lot of times if I can't find anything that says Centro, you know, like instructions how to make this or how to make that, I'll just go and find the Addy one. And I didn't know these machines were out for so long, y'all. These machines have been out for years. And I had no idea. I saw somebody had a video for about seven or eight years ago. And I was like, really? Never heard of these machines. But these these are the more cheaper machines. Uh, I guess for years, when we always go to stores and we see those um, the knitted tops or anything knitted at the store, and we're like, ooh, that looks like a store-bought knit. Or machine knit, I should say. They're usually these big, huge, huge, wide machines. I call them the big boy. That's what um, Lana has at uh, Just Frog. I don't know if she still has it or she says she don't have it anymore. But it's a big, wide machine. Lana, can just, I have it? You just, I, I give you two dollars for it. You just kind of push it back and forth like this, swiping it back and forth. And, you know, instead of, you know, but this machine, you can go back and forth too. Right? Lately, I've done a lot of beanies and ear warmers. I've never done a flat panel. And on here, you can do a flat panel. It has an option. There's a T here and a P here. And I can swipe it up if I want to go P, which is panel. So one day, maybe I'll try that out and we'll have some fun with that. But today, I'm going to make this ear warmer and we'll see how it goes. Let's see who's there. Collar, oh, has put a collar on the clo cloths. Line, Joe was talking smack about my farm animals. I couldn't type. I was about to cry. Oh, don't cry. <laughs> don't cry, Anna. Hey, Holly Dolly HD, how are you doing tonight? Don't cry, no. I'll come, I'll come, I won't eat oinkers. Don't eat oinkers, babe. Come on, how you eat her animals like that? <laughs> he said, that's what I want to do. Oh, my goodness. Yes, everybody shows some love. Flat panel. Oh, you want to do a flat panel? I thought you were talking about you want to eat the farm animals. I didn't know. I was like, nana, 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 don't eat the farm animals. You and your son is crazy. He said, hey, she's Jack Queen. Everybody shows some love. Holly Dolly, Holly Dolly showing some love to her mommy. You know Holly hey? Dolly, we like to party. What you got going on over there, HD? You made anything lately? What did you make for dinner? HD makes some delicious meals, y'all. She does. He said, how did y'all get the picture? How did y'all get the picture? What picture? Oh, did you send it to us? Oh, you said, not how did you? You said, did you? Okay, can you check that email, honey? And send it and see what happened with Barbara's picture. Oh, what was that, honey? Oh, cute. spoon. Oh, it wasn't a scissor. I thought it was a scissor for a minute. I'm over here getting my crank on, y'all. I got to do this for... Oh, I didn't even check to see how many rolls I started with. Ah, babe, how many rolls I got? Goodness. I didn't even check to see how many rolls I had. I got 12 now. I wish I would know how many I had. I don't know. 
Let me see. I got I forgot to count, guys. This has a counter on them, and I didn't get to count. Let me see. One. Let me just try to see if I can read it. Count this. Two, six, seven, eight, nine. I'm thinking it's about nine. I don't know. I don't know. I'm getting sure. Count this. Four, five, six, seven. I don't know how to count this. Those are nice. Seven. One, two, three, four, five. I don't know how to count these rows on here, guys. I think it's seven. Think about seven rows. Mm -hmm. Let's see how it goes. Oh my goodness, Barbara, do you want to show want us to show everybody? You said how that cooks fancy. Yes, she does cook fancy. You said y'all stick to that church meat and leave my farm animals alone. My farm animals alone. So we should we got we got to stick to the church meat. <laughs> we can't eat no. We I'm can't. full. <laughs> uh, I'm, I'm full. Uh huh. Because I'm crocheting baby Afghans, purple and white. What? That sounds amazing, Iris. Okay, you don't care? Okay. Let me see what's going on. Oh, this is gorgeous. Wow, Barbara, look at that. That is beautiful. What kind of yarn is this? Okay, Barbara's showing us. This is our beautiful bag that she made, guys. Look at that bag. Isn't it gorgeous? That is absolutely gorgeous. What kind of yarn is that? Wow, that is beautiful. Bag lady. So, I love my bag. I love my bag. So, awesome, Lana. I will have a new playlist up by then. Cool, cool, cool. I gotta go and check because I don't I'm messed up on that thing. Oh my goodness, is that a poncho? Is that your poncho, Barbara? Look at the poncho, guys. Look at that. Love it. Look at that poncho. This is poncho bag all day. Uh this is her pattern she did. Is this the one I was wearing earlier, isn't it? Yeah. Where's it where's it where's it? Where's it brown? This is it right here. This is the one I did as well. This is the same one that I did right here. Brown. This is the last of the Mohicans. This is the last of the Mohicans, guys. What was the last one I did? I did the gold one. Gold one. The gold one was the last of the family, guys. The gold one was the last of the family, guys. I'm retiring this pan, this pattern from me making it, guys. So the last one I did was a gold one. I'm no longer going to be doing that pattern because I, I'm making my own. But I had a great trip with these guys. I did. If you go back and watch all my videos and the good old days, I made a lot of these. And I'm probably going to... Do a giveaway. Like I said, I'm still gonna do my giveaway, but the giveaway is gonna be with my pattern. But it's gonna be how many patterns of these that I've did over the years. Um, but yeah, my goal was a little. My what was the last one. Right? Mm -hmm. It's so hard <laughs> to say goodbye. <laughs> but guess what? I got a new one. I got my own pattern. My own pattern now. You know. Gorgeous. Yes. Great job, Barbara. You you did such a great job. You are doing a great job. He said, like, Dana, count the bars. Count the bars between the hooks. Don't count the rows. Count the bars between the hooks. Let me see. Let me see. Don't count the rows. Count the bars between the hooks. Count the bars between the hooks. Don't count the rows. I don't know. What am I counting? What am I counting wrong here? One, two, three, four, five. Oh, I think I know what you're talking about now. I think I okay, let me see. I can see on this blue better. One, two, three, four, and five. So this is seven. Are you right then? This is seven. Okay. So more row seven now. Iris wants to know what is this? Did I just go through another row? Seven. Okay, so I'm on eight now? Okay. I'm on eight now. Okay. What does Iris say? What is this? Iris said what is what? Oh, what am I doing? Iris, this is a knitting machine. So if you don't, if you don't know how to knit and you're a crochet like me, because that's all I really know how to do, I'm learning to knit, right? But I still don't have it all the way down pat. So what I'm doing is I'm using a knitting machine. This knitting machine helps you get knitted projects done in no time. Let me show you what a couple of things I've done. These are a couple of beanies I've done with the knitting machine. Here's one of them. And here's another one. Both of these were done with... Um, both of these were done with Mandela yarn. Super cute. They can be folded up and they're reversible. Yeah. Look at that. Isn't that adorable? You can be reversible. You can wear it different ways. Jazz it up. Like I said, you don't have to fold your beanie up, brim up if you don't want. You can, the, brim, the brim can just be, you know, it don't have to be up. It can be down. Depending on how you like to wear them. This is another one. I love this. Kind of gives me a little unicorn vibes. Um... Just like so. And you did your thing. Thank you so much. 
So yeah, I'm just addicted to making these. They're really fun to make. I have a craft fair coming up. And I figured this would be great for a basket. Having different beanies and ear warmers. I think these would be really, really nice to have. Where people can just make up. You know, they can go by and, you know, pick up what they want and buy them. I will be having everything packaged up, though. And I'll probably have um, pictures of how, it's, how they should be worn and things. Because we can't, you know, things are different now. We can't go around trying on stuff and putting this on and putting it back. Like, you know, it's not that time anymore. We have to get to the point where now it's like, okay, you touch it, you buy it, you know? Um, which is kind of unfortunate, but we got we do have to be safe, so. But, yeah, so I'm making an ear warmer now. For those who know, um, I don't know if anybody ever seen the turban ear warmers. Really super cute and stylish. Very, very cute. Did you figure out how to do it? What? Did you count these? Yeah, I counted six blue. Six blue, and then it was, oh, okay. So that means you had eight red. I got eight red now because I'm on fourteen. I'm on fourteen now. I think you got to count these right here. Mm -hmm. In the middle of that, them, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Those little, those little bars that bar I get. Okay. That's just what I get. You got long you got. Mm -hmm. I come from a long line of uh, knitters. You come from a long line of knitters? Okay, mm -hmm. let's see. Just man, that there is a row down inside the one arrow. Around the tiny, oh, two teeth that you have count as well. Okay. Thank you so much. I'm just, I never counted these before. I'm used to letting this machine count it, and I didn't start it right. So I messed myself up. I didn't count how many waist rolls I did. So I'm going to be doing about, I'm thinking about probably like 83 rows for the headband. Depending on what kind of yarn I'm using, if I was using a Kiron Simply Soft, I would do 70 rows. Excuse me. I would do 70 rows, and it would be no, it would be nothing. It would be perfect. But with the thicker yarns, thicker worsted weight yarn, but, you know, it usually 80 or 83 will be good. 83 is perfect. Yes. Okay. So, Nana Sands, have you done it with the, the Kiron Simply Soft? I usually do Simply Soft about 70 rows, and it comes out pretty good. Have you ever did that with the Kiran Simple Soft? My daughter adores the Kiran Simple Soft. She adores it. I'm probably going to make a couple. I'm making so many. I'm super excited. So I'm trying to get lots of things done for this craft here, guys. And on top of writing patterns and all kinds of other stuff, getting videos out. I still got a video I need to get edited. It's on my husband's phone, so I got to get that edited, y'all. And I have to create a new, a new video. I got some Happy Meal today, so I got to get a video done for that. But yes, Iris, if you've never seen this machine, I would definitely say, oops, sorry, look it up. Iris, get a chance. Good night, good night. Oh, I know, I wish you could stay longer too. But I know, probably got to get some work, go to work and everything like that. We appreciate you always hanging out with us. Thank you so much, sis. We good appreciate night. you. Love you. Have a yes. good night. Good night. Hugs and kisses. Be blessed. Don't let the bed buzz by. We love you and thank you for your support. So just started cooking with Catalina for my Tuesday playlist, buddy. Thank you so much, Noni Man. So it comes out beautiful, but much smaller. I have to go 85 to 90. Oh, really? What your um what the um what was it called? What did I say? Mm -hmm. The Kiran Simply Soft. Really? It comes out smaller. Okay. Every time I do Simply Soft, I do it with the 70 rows and it comes out really good. I got that from Taylor Lynn, and she has a video on it, and it came up pretty good. Let me see. Oh, but you know what, Nana's Hands? I'm doing this with a, this is a bigger machine, too. I forgot about that. This machine has more needles on it. He has a couple more needles. He said, Joe, are you looking? What are you looking at? You already tired? Yeah. I'm like, it's time to wake up. He's so quiet, isn't he? I was just tired. I was oh, for when he was talking, baby. Oh, okay. Okay. I'll let you explain your, your what you're doing. Oh, okay. Yeah. You can talk now, baby. Yeah. You, you want to talk to show some of your hooks? Yeah. Yeah, most of everybody seen them. I forgot. That's probably why. But I think Taylor Lynn, she ended up using a... She was using an Addy, too, though. So I don't know. She was using an Addy, but she might have a smaller head, too. She looks like she has a smaller head. I definitely don't have a smaller head. <laughs> I have a larger head, so... But my daughter usually wears the hat, hat the beanie and stuff. I might try to do all of them that size or that one because um, my daughter has a small head too. Now that I think about it, and I don't think I ever put one on. I think I usually make them for her, and that's it. So now I'm gonna try and see what it's like. What's, where am I at now, babe? 
Thirty something. Thirty four. Mm. Babe, can you crank a little bit for me? Not crank. How how about holding? I don't know. I don't know. I can crank some while, while I just hold the string regular. No, I don't know. I can hold it. Oh, because it. I got this thing. I forgot. Yeah, I don't know how you gonna hold it. Really. No, I got it. Uh, I got to see if they can send me another one, hopefully. I don't know how you're supposed to hold that, how, how hard you're supposed to hold it. You're supposed to hold it taut or what you supposed to do? Mm -hmm. You said, what machine? Hey, Laura. Um, yeah, no, it's kind of hard. How are you doing tonight? I'm using a Centro knitting machine. And I love this machine. I've had it. What did I get for Christmas? I got it for Christmas, guys. And uh, I love this machine. It gets the job done, Laura. Have you ever had any knitting machines before? Oh, you look like it. Don't feel like it. I was wondering. It sure don't feel like it. Joe looks like he he's about to fall out. <laughs> Dana, he was staring off in his face. He's too calm now. Is he? Wake up. No, I'm not. Get some coffee, honey. I was just sitting over here. I let you do what you do. Then you just doing what you're doing. I was just sitting here. Cool beans. Oh, you have a cat. Oh. Well, see, Laura, you got the good stuff. Come on, can I hang out with you? Whatever. You don't drink it off you do. There you go. Laura says she has the Addy King. Yeah, that's what Nana's hands too. I think Nana hands has them all. She has every single Addy. That's what I'm gonna work my stuff up to. Eventually, after I use this up, I'm I'm not very I'm very satisfied with this though. Yeah, he's a give. Is that short thing? Okay. That's why I'm happy to hear that. <laughs> I can come hang out with you then. But yeah, I'm pretty satisfied with this though. I am. I can't. I can't. I have to admit though, I'm pretty satisfied. I made my money back on it already. Oh, uh, Davidson says, give him some food from church. I'm full. Is that I don't have the tiny? Oh, you don't have a tiny one? I don't know why I thought you had the tiny one, Davidson. I'm full. I just want to see how this is gonna work up, y'all. This chair is pretty. Mine got like twenty of them. Yes, Lanny, Lana has them too. Is Lana going to sleep already? I need to hang out with Nana's hands and Lana. They both got all the, the Addies. Lana, the cheaper in Canada. I want to get me. I want to get. That's what I really want. I'm going to eventually get one. Maybe I'll try to get one for my birthday. I'm going to need Jesus if we're going to do that. Or we can drive the Addy down the street. Yeah, so do you want to tell Elijah's story? We're going to wait until another day to tell the story about having Elijah. We'll tell Elijah's story. You tell now? Okay, guys. So we've got a crazy story to tell you guys. It's a little serious matter. Um, but, so don't go anywhere. I'm still finishing this up, guys, okay? But I got to take a break because I don't want to be too loud, okay, right? All right, so last week, I believe it was Wednesday. Yeah. It was last Wednesday, guys. So we came on late. No, it wasn't last Wednesday. It was it last Thursday? Last Tuesday. It was last Tuesday. Last Wednesday, OBW was doing her. No, she was dying on Thursday. But Wednesday, we still went to her thing that we were singing. So I think it was Thursday, Tuesday. Yeah, it was Tuesday. I think it was last Tuesday, guys, right? You got all the for Christmas Day. Oh, did you? Yeah, Atlanta. When you see a Christmas deal again, please let us know, okay? Or any kind of deal, if you see one. I mean, not go searching for it. But anyway, sorry. So it was last Tuesday, guys. And I was doing, yeah, y'all knew this. It was last Tuesday, because Monday and Tuesday, I was doing my niece's hair. And uh, I was braiding it up with some extensions. And so uh, we braided, I braided it up Monday, and then it was taking too long. So the next day I finished it up. Denny was here. She said, Oh, do you get it done with your niece's hair? We was talking about it. That's how I'm sending pictures of y'all when I get done. But I didn't even get to finish it, finish it like I wanted to. Um, I finished the braids, but anyways. So Tuesday came, and uh, we, for anybody who knows about hair and braids and extensions, um, she wanted, I was going to curl her hair. I was going to curl the extensions of the braids. So I was going to put rods on them. For those who know what rods are, many people know what rods are. They're perm rods. If you ever had a perm or if you ever had a jerry curl, you need those rods to create this perm. Okay. So, or this curl. Okay. So I was going, I had my, I had rotted my niece's hair. I started riding it up, getting it ready. And I told my daughter, I said, honey, I need you to go and boil some water. Well, don't boil it. Just put some in the microwave. Get a bowl, put it in the microwave, and put it on, I think, 10 minutes. Put it on 10 minutes in the microwave. Cool. So she had it done. She was like, oh, mommy, I, have my, I didn't have the, um, I was rolling the rods up. So I had ro rolled her hair up, and she said, okay. Um, and I had, after I got it done, my daughter told me to ride the hair up or whatever. So we was doing good. 
Next thing you know, I told my daughter, I said, go get a towel for um, our niece. And, so put, I can, and put the water back on five more minutes. Yeah, put the water on five more minutes because I wasn't done riding. I was still kind of riding it a little bit, and I wanted to still be good. So she went there and put it on some more minutes or whatever, and um, I told her to go grab a towel. She was like, I can't find a towel. So I'm like, let's go look for a towel. Go find one. So um, that minutes had passed, and she had never got a towel. And me and my husband were just talking. We wasn't, I wasn't paying attention at the time that went by. And she hadn't been out there. Because usually if, I, if you take too long, I'm like, let me just go get it. I didn't end up going to go get it because me and my husband was talking. I forgot time. I just forgot. Next thing you know, we sit outside. And we just hear, boom. Sorry if I scared anybody. I'm dramatic. Joe said, babe, babe, go in the house to see what happened. No, it wasn't that boom that I heard. I heard. Ah! Well, at the top of her lungs. Screen. Oh, I didn't hear that. I don't know what you was hearing. I, I didn't hear that. All I heard was boom. I didn't hear a scream. At the top of her lungs. I wow. Said, I didn't hear the scream. All I heard was boom. I just heard a thud, so I didn't know. And so my husband, my husband and my son heard her scream at the top of her lungs. I didn't hear it. So I ran in the house and I opened up the door. I ran in and I said, "What's going on?" Joe said, "Joe said, babe, go in there and see if she ain't spilled out water." So I ran in the house and she was. Her face was drenched. Her face was covered in that hot, scalding water, and she was just crying her eyes out, sitting on the floor, just soaked. And so my mom ran in, my husband ran in, and we just automatically was like, you need to pull, you need to go in the, in the I, sink. I couldn't run in. Yeah, well, Joe couldn't run in, but I'm just saying afterwards, you end up coming in, right? You came in afterwards, yeah. But so we ran in the kitchen, and um, she started spraying water. We told her to spray cool water on your face. It was just burning. Her face was burning. And uh, all of her eyes, all of her face, she was just burning. So we said, put the water on your face, spray it. You got to spray it for at least 20 to 30 minutes so that way it can calm that burn down. And so um, her skin was still intact and everything. So we like, okay, first degree. And, you know, so, you know, she didn't have anything. You couldn't see anything, no no problems, but she was just in pain. So my mom like, oh, we need to go to the hospital. We need to do this. We need to do that. And it was just, everybody was frantic because we was just like, what's going on? Like, we were scared. My daughter was scared. We got to stay strong for her. Let her know she's going to be okay. And she just spraying this water on her face, spraying it. She crying. I said, babe, don't cry because you're going to give yourself a headache and you already get pain from the burn. So she just crying and crying. I'm like, honey, just please don't cry. So she just spraying her face. She sprayed her face for a while. And it had been like 30 or 40 minutes and the burn had caught, began to calm down. And our car, you know, our car is messed up. And for the, by the grace of God, Joe was able to go to the store and go grab. Um, this car let me drive it, y'all. Yeah. He That's was, how good God is. Mm -hmm. This car let me make it to the store in this car to go get something for this burn for this girl's mm -hmm. face. Don't know how to, this car will not move today. Mm -hmm. This car will not move, but this car let me drive it to the store. And so he went to the store to go get like neosporins, gauze, and different things like that for a burn. And um, she still didn't have any burn. She didn't have no type of burns on her face, nothing. And uh, we, we was trying to, she was still spraying it down. And so um, later on that day, she, like later that night, like right after she got done, she started calming down a little bit, gave her some pain medicine. And she sat on, we didn't put on New York or nothing on at first because, you know, you ain't supposed to put nothing on at first. So she sat in, on the couch and she put it on the fan on her face and it was just cooling her down. She started feeling so much better and that pain medicine kicked in and, and helped her go to sleep. And so then the next day when she woke up, her face was just swollen. Her eye was swollen shut. Um, and her face was just, um, was it, what was her face? What was her, what was her face? I can't remember her face. Her, face is, her eyes were swollen and her skin was like, just like dark. Like, yeah, her skin started like, scalding that. But was that, it, did it like get dark, dark or was it a little dark? It was a little dark. It was like a little was dark. Like, and her, yeah. And her eye was real swollen. Her other eye was like a little bit going on. You could see. And then the next day it started getting real dark. And uh, she came down before it was crazy. Before she came down that morning, Joe had started feeling his spirit that she was gonna start getting nervous and scared, and she was gonna get like you know what I'm saying, start getting doubtful and feel like she was gonna be you know her face. She loves her face, and you know she's not saying she's superficial or um, shallow, but she was bullied as a younger kid. She was bullied. She was talked about, and so now she's getting to that age where she's starting to love herself, love her looks, and you know those types of things. You know how teenagers go teenagers go through different things. So now she's getting to that stage, and so she, Joe was like, I feel like she's going to wake up feeling sad. I don't know what's going to happen. So he texted her in the morning and said, babe, I love you. You're beautiful. Don't worry. Don't get discouraged. She came down that morning and just busting out tears. She was so scared. She seen herself in the mirror, and her face started getting dark. 
and it was like you could see that the the burn was taking place and the burn was like you know showing that was a burn when you get a burn the skin turns dark it starts to um you know a, a texture you get a whole burnt texture and so she was so worried she was so sad she came down and laid on us and hugged and cried and we was just like, you're going to be okay. You know, you got to heal up. You're going to go through a crackling and appealing process. You're going to do all that stuff. And she was like, in the back of her mind, she wanted to listen to us, but still her head was telling her, no, I'm going to look like this forever. And she was just so discouraged. And so um, we ended up putting like neosporins and things like that on there to keep it in moist because her face had got so tight. She had burnt up on top of her lip here and she had burnt up her eye. Like one of her eyes was like right up in here in her eyelid, but the other eyelid was just super swollen shut. Um, all of this was all just swollen and everything. And so um, then she started dealing with that. And then later on, later on that day, or next day, what happened? You got your picture in the original pictures? Oh, I was trying to find see if she sent me anything. I told her to send them. Okay. Mm -hmm. Should I send her? Yo, go get a lot of your phone and try to send me those pictures. Yeah, she, uh, Joseph can get in her phone. Go and get Sammy's phone and open it up and bring it so I can show a picture of the picture. So, um, so she ended up getting the, her face done like the next day or like a couple days later. We kept telling her, you're going to be okay. So then, then a couple days later, she started peeling. And she just started feeling like a whole different person. We started talking to her and, you know, you know, we could get into jokes and we could start making her laugh. Right, babe? We could start making her laugh. She started yeah. getting a little bit more. But her face started peeling, y'all, and she started realizing, like, okay, it was, it, I'm, I am okay, you know. But she's doing a lot better now, guys. Um, it's been about, so it's actually today will be a week, um, and she's doing a lot. Her healing process is going really, really well. Um, she has like a couple bits of um, pink spots. Yeah, she got a couple pink spots where the skin has to come back to its regular color. But other than that, she's looking very close to being herself again, y'all. I'm telling you, and. Um, it was such a scary situation. It was very scary. For it was very I scary. I mean, I mean, for a teenage girl, like mm -hmm. you said, very yeah. scary. Situation. Very scary, you know. But I could look at her right away and tell what was gonna happen. Yeah. I just looked at her and told her what was what was gonna happen. Mm -hmm. You know, from my experience with yeah burns with and burns stuff like that. And stuff and, you know, you can tell the difference if it's a first degree or second and third because of what happens with that. What you know, her skin automatically would have been different from she. Her skin wouldn't have been intact after if it wasn't a first degree burn. It would have been a whole different level. And so, um, you got it? You got a picture? It's over. Oh. Okay, let me see. Was there a different spot? Oh, okay. Well, give me the, the first one, like, the next day. Something as close, oh, as, close, yeah, close as much as you can. And so, she getting healed. She, I mean, she's looking so much better. She is. I just sent her to my phone. She was kept on asking, like, oh, can y'all look at me? How can y'all stand and look at me? I don't look pretty. Girl, I'm not pretty. Okay. I'm not beautiful. She kept on saying it over and over again. Why don't, you know, like, she was just feeling so, me, like, and she kept saying, I'm one, sorry, I'm so one, sorry. One. Like, she kept on saying it over and over, I'm so sorry, please don't be mad at me. I'm like, we're not mad at you. It's a mistake, you know, and it's okay. You know, she wanted to bring the water out to me where I was doing my niece's hair at. She wanted to bring it out to me to where I was doing it at. Y'all, this, this young lady is so helpful. Yeah, she's very helpful, like, you know? She's unbelievably helpful. Like, yes. she's always been that way, mm -hmm. and that's just how she is. She can't. Yeah. She just can't be, you know what yes. I'm saying? She, that's the type of young lady she is. Mm -hmm. She always trying to help anybody she can, and she loves mm -hmm. loves young, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Young kids. She She's like, a, yeah, she very good like mentor. To. Like I said, Boys and Girls Club, everything. Mm -hmm. Everything. He's sending them? No, he's sending them now. Come on, Joe, send them to me. Yeah. He's sending them, yep. Yeah. So she's, that's just how she is. That's what everybody's saying, yeah. Okay, he said, yeah, she said, use preparation H for burns, really? You said you did right with putting the cold water on her skin, but burns shows the blisters the next day, yep. You're right, she's a teenage girl, yep. She didn't have any blisters, I think, guys, there was no blisters, there was none of that. She just had a lot of swelling, though. She said, I fell asleep and I go just listen to the story, wow. Thank you so much, see if I can just find Silver Jill. You can find Silver Jill, CVS Cares, oh, thank you so much. So, I her girl, she's listening. Girl, you said Yes. He said, didn't burn her eyes. I know, thank God didn't burn her eyes. If she has a scare, scar, okay, thank you so much, Rosemary. You know, Rosemary's a nurse, so she knows about that. That silver works too. Thank y'all. He said, keep her some preparation on hand. Thank you so much. Yeah, I'm keeping all that stuff on hand, y'all. Thank y'all so much. Yes, yes, yes. It's sorry to hear that you, so Albert, oh, wow. So everybody got everything. Thank y'all so much. Hello, Vera, too. 
I'm going to keep her in thoughts and prayers. Thank y'all so much. Glad she's doing better. Thank you so much, Lord. Yeah, you sent one more pic to me? Okay, thank you so much, Barbara. Check it out. I could have could have been worse, but God damn. Chit check me. It could have been worse. It could have been worse. My niece is a nurse at Mayo Clinic for Burn Center. They put preparation on Burn Victim for pain. Oh, thank you so much, Noni. I appreciate that. Yes, because yes, I need we need, make sure we keep different things on our hand. But she's like, I'm never touching that water again. Yeah, right, right here. This was the next day, y'all, when she had ended up waking up. I don't know if this is the next. Was it the next day? This is our next day, y'all. And you can see her face is swollen really badly, y'all. Swollen. She was just so disappointed in herself because she's so smart. And when you know she makes a mistake, she just feels so down on herself. We just kept telling her, "Don't be discouraged. Don't you know?" Just and then she had like a picture up close. Her. She wanted to kind of show like a little up close picture, you know. As her eye was swollen up real bad. And then she started peeling. She was kind of showing like little pictures of her peeling her chin. Okay, see, her chin and stuff was starting to peel. Then y'all. And then her, she started peeling a little bit more. She started coming into herself a little bit, but you can still see the burnt skin here. But she was peeling. And then she's showing another picture right here. We're starting to peel a little bit. And then there's another picture where she was peeling some more guys. Going through her peeling stages. And there goes another picture over here. She's showing a little bit of her frontal face. And another one on the side. A little bit more in the front area here. And she has more pictures. And another picture. She's starting to heal up a lot more. You can see her eyes and stuff. They look the same. She's starting to look like herself again. And she woke up and she was here. I have a little face on. Pick. And then this is her starting to do more peeling. Like I said, her eyes is looking back at herself again. Looking more like herself. And all she got to do is more peeling. Just a little bit more peeling. And she's showing a little bit more of her skin here. And that's about I think that's it. But she got some more. Like now she got more pictures. Like if you see her picture on Facebook. Sunday. Now oh, I have that picture of her on Sunday. That was her Sunday. Yeah, let me show you a picture of her yesterday, y'all. Outside for uh, ch for church yesterday, Father's Day, guys. She ended up doing a camouflage. She didn't put makeup on her on her on her skin. I mean, on her where she had was uh, peeled at. She kind of left it peeled, but she put her hair over it so you can see. But she put makeup on the other. She was able to put makeup on the other part of her skin, now. So let me see. Let me get a picture. I ain't got a picture by herself, then. She should got a picture by herself too. She was looking really cute. Okay. Hold on, guys. I wish I was on gallery. Let me go gallery. Camera. Where's camera? Camera, camera from here. Okay. Where's the camera? Okay. So this is a picture of her right here. Standing with Joe. We put this picture on Facebook. But let me show. Let me zoom in a little bit if I can. You can't really see. She looks right. She's looking back at herself again. Looking like back at herself. She just got a little bit right her hair. Is that right here? Where her hair is. She has a little bit of that peeling. Just a but little bit. But you can't bit. see it anymore. She... And it's really, it's really, she's not healed up. Look at her, y'all. God is so good. Look at that. God is so good, y'all. I'm telling you, he is just so good. He is so, so good, y'all. Hey. No, ain't no looking at that. That's it's all, all God. God. He get all the glory for that, y'all. ain't no looking at that. This is some pictures we took at church, y'all. That's all God. Look at that right there. And this is the pictures we took outside the church. This is a little picture that Joe took with the children. Outside the church. The only thing I don't like how the handicap sticker was a photobomb, but. Other than that, everybody was looking good. I wish I got a picture of us, but I'm waiting for tomorrow, y'all. I can see the pictures of us tomorrow for five, for what's it called? For our anniversary. Since our anniversary is here tomorrow. But yeah, I got pictures of Joe and our oldest son. So hard to see on this camera. My camera won't want to focus because it's a camera, I guess. But yeah, that's a picture. And our youngest son. Joe took some pictures by himself. He got on his shoes. You know, he loved those shoes, those sparklies. He got. But yeah, it was a good day. But I just thank God, y'all. I'm telling y'all. Very, very scary, y'all. Very uh, nerve wracking situation. You're talking about your firstborn child. And, you know, like, uh, but she's like, now nah, I'm not touching any water. You got to worry about me touching it. I don't care if it's cold bottle water. I'm not <laughs> but no, but, you know, I just, I'm thank God for that, you know. 
We all go through different things, and we all have a testimony. See, that's now she got testimony, you know? And we got to have a testimony. So we got to go through something so we can be able to tell somebody else and help somebody else. Whatever the story may be, who knows? Only God knows that. But we got to have one. We got to have one to tell. And when we make it out of it, it's going to be God to get the glory because can't nobody else do it. You know, can't nobody else do that. Can't nobody else get on glory and say, oh, yeah, I got that. If it wasn't for if it wasn't for my neighbor down the street, you know what I'm saying? No, it, God, it has to be God. It got to be God. But I'm just, oh, my goodness. You say God's healing her. Wow, it could have been much more. Yes, it could have been much worse. Get some shade and some cocoa butter. Okay. Thank you, Rosemary. You said luck was, it was only minor burns. Thanks to the grace of God. Yes. She's okay. Thank y'all so much for the love, y'all. Yes, our daughter. Hey, Scarlett, I'm not sure if you're still here. You still here, Scarlett? Let me know if you're still here. Bless her heart. Yeah, she's so good. Thank you so much. Thank y'all so much for the love. Yes, girls are very sensitive teens. Yes, you are. You're right, Rosemary. Thank God she's okay. Yes, yes, yes. My niece and nurse. Oh, yeah, we see. I read that. Yes, y'all. That was just a very, oh, my goodness, y'all. Y'all don't even know. And, like, we didn't get to come on here until y'all that night on Tuesday night when we came on. We just had them, like, we was like, you know, we was like still so kind of frantic about it. And, you know, just like so much going on. We were like, we're going to wait. We'll just wait. You know, let's just wait. And then we'll wait till you know, God can get the glory. We'll do the glory story. And we was going to actually have her come on and talk about it a little bit. But she ended up going to sleep on us. So, but she's doing so much better. I just thank God she is on y'all. Because that's, I'm telling y'all. Woo. They are nice pics of the family. I emailed you a picture of the set room. Oh, did you? Okay. All right, sis Lisa, I came in to see that. How you doing tonight? I'm so glad you're here. So I heard that before. The office went, we put water in our office, coffee cup, heat up in the microwave. You said, I never heard, I've heard that before in the office when we put water in our coffee cup and heat up in the microwave. You heard what? What happened? What'd you hear about Nana's hands? Thank you so much, Noni Man. You said, you better wear that pink jump. <laughs> yes. You said, beautiful love, Joe Shoes. Oh, thank you so much, Kelly. Yes. Okay, you see her? Okay, yes. Did she trip? Yes, she tripped, Rosemary. She tripped on a cord. That's what happened. So, Scarlett, you here. Oh, that exposed? Really? Oh, snap. She has a testimony. Yes, she do have a testimony. She said, Lord, such a protector. Yes, thank you, Lord, for his holy angels watching over her and her daughter. Thank you so much. Yes. So, Scarlett, last week our daughter um was heating up some hot water in a bowl um for me to niece's hair, and she wanted to bring it out to me and uh she was bringing it out to me she tripped over a cord and it's it fell and the water f uh landed right on her face splashed right up against her skin on her face and left left her eyes swollen and uh, her face very uh burned and uh she was kind of getting it was a first degree burn um uh, thank god so that way uh, now she's doing a lot better she's healing and she's peeling very well and now basically her skin, she's gonna go through her skin, uh, you know, the color and things coming back on it. She's gonna get cocoa butters, Moderma's and things like that to make sure, you know, she's really even in things. But it was a really, really kind of scary situation. And just trying to get her calmed down. That was the main thing, trying to get her back calmed down. Because, you know, when you get your kids, you know, they you, that's what uh, as parents, you gotta stay calm so that way you can keep them calm. But whew just kind of scary a little bit y'all but i just thank god that we're good if she's good okay you said working with children and teenagers in the ar believe me it's a common accident is it wow okay that's good that's good i mean it's not good that's common but it's good that you see people you know that you see them making out of it and they're doing all right but yeah she was just so hurt she was like i can't believe like she was so down on herself like i'm 17 you know, i'm almost 18 and you know I, you know, but we all make mistakes. Nobody's perfect. That's the thing. Nobody's perfect. We all can make mistakes. We all have issues, and I mean, you know, we have things that we, you know, do accidentally. It it's all accident. Oh yeah, I forgot. He doesn't make too many mistakes, guys. I'm sorry, but yeah, you know, so God is so good and powerful. God completely gets all the glory through His healing. Yes, He does. You're right. He gets it all. He said, "What making on the machine? I'm gonna be making a cute little ear warmer, y'all. Some little cute turban ear warmers." I'm gonna make up a whole bunch of different things for this craft here. I got the beanies made up. Sweetie, did you see the beanies already? I don't know if you're here when I'm showing off the beanies, but I got the beanies. I got a couple beanies done. I'm gonna. I have tons of this Mandela that scrap. That I. I don't think I can make anything big with it. So I'm saying I'm gonna make up a whole bunch of beanies with all the Mandela I got. So I'm gonna make up some beanies. And I'm gonna. These are reversible, so you can wear them either way. <clears throat> I'm gonna make up beanies, ear warmers. 
and maybe a couple bags because Kiki's Crochet makes bags with her machine. And uh, she gave me an idea to make some bags up. So I'm thinking about maybe trying a couple bags. And with this machine, because Nana's hands was telling me, make use your machine and whip up some stuff. And I'm just like, hmm. I sat over the corner and forgot about it. So now I'm so glad that I'm just using it again. So wow, Dana, I'm so glad you thank you so much, Scarlett. I appreciate you so much. Beauty comes with from within first. Yes, you're right. Yes, you are right, Kelly. You are so right. It comes within first. But when you got these teenagers, you can tell them that, but until they learn it, you know, sometimes it's hard for them to learn that, you know? Or when they're going through different things because of their friends. It's not even about that, you know? It's not even about that because you can believe it yourself, but then you have somebody tell you something and when you're a teenager and you start getting those, going through different hormones and, you know, it, it happens like that because you're like, oh, well, such and such says this. It could be one person mad about some situ jealousy or envy tell you something. Oh, well, I don't like, you don't look good or you're, your outfit's ugly or whatever and you believe them. It's just so much. When you get older, you kind of get to that mindset like, oh, I really don't care. I could care less. I'm doing this. I'm not doing this for you, you know. But when you're a teenager and going through all these different things, it's kind of hard to, you know, it's kind of hard to not believe or not listen to what these people say. Yeah, you should definitely have her put shea butter on her face to help replenish her skin. Thank you so much. Helps rebuild the skin from the, ooh, thank you, Laura. Okay, yeah, so everybody show some love. Thank y'all so much. Make sure we get everything for that. He said, I just finished my hair. Ooh, okay, you gotta go to bed. I know, Kelly, I was like, Kelly, you still up, niece? You still up. We love you so much. Thank you again for everything. You always support us and show us so much love. God bless. Sleep tight and let the bed bugs bite. Enjoy work tomorrow. Can't okay, wait. Well, you can do a cute little twist out. Everybody's a part of Kelly's family, y'all. If y'all part of my niece Kelly, does everybody know my niece Kelly? I can put our link up. Noni May, if you're still here, if there's a way you can please put our niece Kelly's link up. Or y'all can put y'all links up too. Everybody, mostly everybody is really family here. But I don't know if, since Kelly is so new, our niece Kelly, not Crochet Me Pink Kelly, which is our awesome friend. Um, but Kelly's our niece, and she's at Kelly's Crochet Adventures. And I don't know if anybody's part of her family yet. She's just kind of getting out there. She has two videos, and she just did her first, uh, her second one today, well, yesterday. And she's really, really awesome, y'all. She's super sweet. She's making up all kind of cute goodies. And um, you will not be very, uh, you will not be unpleased at her videos. Y'all will love her. She's super sweet. If y'all love me, y'all love her. And uh, it was kind of nervousing. It was kind of nervousing. That's my new word, y'all. It was kind of nervousing for her to get out and to do videos and to get out in this crochet world. Oh, but she's been wanting to do it for a long time. So if y'all can please support her and just say, hey, you know, just say hello and just hit the thumbs up for her and just show her that, you know, she's not a bad person. She's a sweetheart, you know. <laughs> That'd be amazing. We appreciate it so much. You said you could use that to make a mermaid tail crochet, a tail on, and, oh, a baby swallow for a photo shoot. Ooh, Barbara. I love those, uh, the tails, the little mermaid tails. You are so right. Sarah Story is already doing God things because now I won't ask my grandson to heat up hot water and bring it to me because it's clumsy. But yes, exactly. My daughter is clumsy. Uh, she gets it from me. I, I'm kind of clumsy too. I'm getting a little bit out of it, but I still have my clumsy stages. And uh, I still have my clumsy stages and I'm almost 33. So, you know, my daughter, she gets it from me. And, um, uh, I just kind of feel bad because I didn't know she was getting the water and I would have just told her, don't get it. Like, I just, I, I, I know she's getting healed up now. And I know what God had, it had to happen. You know, that's one of my little phrases I like to say, if I'm going to get a t-shirt made, it had to happen. Um, but I just wish I could have went back and said, you know, don't, don't just make sure you don't grab it. I don't need you to grab it, you know, but I know, I know it had to happen, you know. He said, tell Elijah that we love her, we pray for her, and that she's so photogenic. God has blessed her to heal her so beautifully. Always remind, remember, God got her. She got the best parents. Oh, thank you so much, Nana's hands. And then she got so discouraged because she had to stop working. She, like, literally, you know, she told her boss, I couldn't work. And so she couldn't get anything for Joe for his birthday or for Father's Day because she really didn't work much. And um, she was, like, so discouraged because she's like, oh, I couldn't get anything for Father's Day. And Joe's like, I don't care. I'm about you give me anything for Father's Day. I really want you to bed and just make sure you're good. You know, because she talked to her boss. Her boss is really understanding. She's like, you know, I have to be off for a while. And she took, she's going to be going back Thursday. But she had to take all that time off because, you know, she had to make sure she was healing. Vitamin E oil will help. Oh, thank you so much, Noni May. I got to make sure I write her stuff down. I got an ink pen somewhere. I had an ink pen in my notebook all day today. Now I don't know where it's at. So, oh, my goodness. Where's my notebook and stuff I have, babe? It's right here. Oh, here it goes. I'm like, I know I had a notebook in my ink pen next to me. All that goes right down the pattern. 
And I want to write this stuff down. I want to have to go back to the chat and read it. That's gonna be too much. That's gonna be too hard work. If I can find my email, you can't find it. This is what you're doing. <clears throat> Let me see what everybody's saying. I don't want to miss everybody's comments. Let me see. Let me see what everybody's saying. So I understand it's hard for that age. Thank God, too. She's getting better and healing. Oh, yes. Thank you so much, Kelly. I shot a Kelly out of my channel. Oh, my goodness. Thank you so much, Noni May. Watch both her videos. She got some great new yarn. She's so sweet. Oh, thank you so much, Rosemary. What's the link? Okay, here's Kelly's link. Thank you so much, Kelly. Thank you, Seth. I'm 48 and trip over my own feet. Oh, my. Laura, I'm I'm very clumsy. I used to be a waitress. It's hilarious. We were playing a game of Family Feud. And they said, what is a job? What is a bad job for a clumsy person? And uh, I was the first one. To, I got it right. We were playing it at um, Crystal's at uh, Jumping Frog Dream Creations. And I heard and said, waitress. I used to be a waitress. And Joe would come in and make me so nervous. Uh, I don't got my phone charger in. My phone charger in. All this time. Okay. Joe would come in and he would make me so nervous. He would be coming in like just we first started dating, he came. Well, we'll talk more about that, I guess, tomorrow. But he used to make me spill stuff all the time when he'd come in while I was working. Yes, thank you, Kelly. I know what you were saying. Thank y'all so much. We are friends now. Thank y'all so much for the love. She's a really sweetheart now. So yeah, I'm just working on these right here. See See what's gonna come out to be like, guys. He said maybe she's experiencing this now because she will need the knowledge. She will need to the knowledge and experience to help someone else in the future. Yep, I believe we learn hard. Yep, you're right. We do. You, we do, and that's why we all. Everything we do is for a reason. Everything it happens for a reason. Everything. You know, when we're going through it, it doesn't feel too good. You know, when we're going through all these different hardships, and we we either lose somebody or something goes wrong. It does not feel good. You know, and we we can't understand why. We want to question it. But when we get done going through it and, you know, things get better, uh, it just is such an amazing, we get such an amazing, uh, go through a great victory and it's such an amazing story to be able to tell somebody and share some with somebody else. I drop everything at least once. Then knocking over other things. I know I do the same thing all the time. I probably drop something every week. I probably do something. Every, it could be once a day. I don't know. It might be once a day. For every couple, every couple. Of... What happened? It's a woman. Oh. Um, He's in there trying to be back, trying to be quiet. Just a woman. Good shot, son. Y'all see that? That's what I get. Now you're going to act like. What's going on? Your eye itching? Yeah. So you're not clumsy? You're not clumsy? No. Oh, yeah, he, he's not clumsy. He's not. <laughs> <laughs> I thought I could just give him a say he was. He no. said, Joe's over there not. <laughs> Joe has a flashback of the food. <laughs> you have a flashback of that food that you eating? Mm -hmm. that, good, that good eating? Mm -hmm. Y'all, I hope this is going to be enough. <laughs> they said, we need to hear a song. Okay, we need to hear a song. Babe, you ready to hear a song? Mm-hmm. Go ahead, sing one for us. No, I'm so much in. Come on, sing one. That's what you, you can't sing that for us? Mm -hmm. Come on. I live my hands. In total duration unto you reign on the throne for you are God and God alone because of you my cloudy days are gone I can sing to you this song I just want to say that I love you more than anything. I lift my hands in total adoration to you. You reign, you reign on the throne. For you are God and God alone. Because of you, my cloudy days are gone. I can sing to you this song. I just want to say that I love you more than anything. Joe, so where my water at? I love you, Jesus. I worship and adore you. Just want 
to tell you, Lord, I love you more than anything. I love you, Jesus. I love you, Jesus. I worship and adore you. Just want to tell you, Lord, I love you more than anything. Oh, 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 You to the words of you, I live. Oh, 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 to worship, to worship you. I live to the words of you, to worship you. I live, I live to worship you. To the words of you, I live to worship you. I live, oh, to worship. To worship you, I live. To worship you. To worship you, I live. I live to worship you. Jesus went to Calvary to save a wretch like you and me. That's love. That's love. Jesus went to Calvary to save a wretch like you and like me. Like you and me. That's love. That's love. That's love. That's love. That's love. They hung him up, stressed and wide. They hung him high, stressed and wide. They stretched him wide. He hung his head. They hung his head. For me, for me, he died. That's love. That's love. That's love. That's love. They hung him high, stretched him wide. They hung him high, stretched him wide. They stretched him wide. He hung his head. He hung his head. For me, he died. For me, he died. That's love. That's love. That's love. But that's not a story. But that's not how story ends. the story ends. Three days later, three days later, rose again. he rose again. That's love. 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 One more time. That's love. Yes, yes, yes. Kelly said, how did your singing go, Dana, at choir practice? You were worried about, well, it went okay, but the singing on Sunday, the song that we were worried about, well, Joe was worried about, Joe said that overall, the choir got a D. Okay, we did four songs. The first three, they got A pluses on. The last song they got a D. Ah, <laughs> uh, yes. Sweet Tea wants to say, I need you to survive. You ready? Come on. You guys sing this for Sweet Tea. I don't got no voice. Sweet Tea loves us. We got your love to Sweet Tea. Come on. I don't got no voice. Bro. Come on, man. Let's do this. Let's do this. Let's do this. Let's do a song. Let's just do a song. We're going to sing hard. Come on. We're going to sing. We got you, Sweet Tea. We got you, Sweet Tea. Sweet Tea, you usually got to go to sleep. Sweet Tea is hanging out like wet clothes tonight. So we got to hang. We got to show some love to Sweet Tea. Okay, ready? We're going to sing for you, Sweet Tea. Don't go to sleep, y'all. Hold on. We're going to sing for you. Thank God for the love, y'all. Thank God for the love. I'm gonna sing it somewhere that have zero voice. I know we're gonna just sing soft because Joe, we got to reserve Joe's voice since he's the um. And it, Dana, do what I told you. Just open up, sis. You got it. Oh, thank you so much, Manda. 
Ma, did you hear a story about our daughter? Did you hear we were telling a story about our daughter? And you just woke back up, Ma. You got you, you got a little bit of rest and woke back up. Okay, everybody girl is saying. He said, where voice went? Where voice went, Joe? Okay. You ready? I need you. You need me. We're all a part of God's body. Stand with me. Agree with me. We're all a part of God's body. It is His will that every need be supplied. You are important to me. I need you to survive. You are important to me. I need you to survive. I need you. I need you. You need me. We're all a part of God's body. Stand with me. Agree with me. We're all a part of God's body. It is His will that every need be supplied. You are important to me. I need you to survive. You are important to me. I need you to survive. I pray for you. I pray for you. You pray for me. I love you. I need you to survive. I won't harm you with words from my mouth. I love you. I need you to survive. It is His will that every need be supplied. You are important to me. I need you to survive. You are important to me. I need you to survive. I pray for you one more time. I pray for you. You pray for me. I love you. I need you to survive. I won't harm you with words from my mouth. I love you. I need you to survive. I pray. I pray for you. You pray for me. I love you. I need you to survive. I won't harm you with words from my mouth. I love you. I need you to survive. I pray for you. You pray for me. I love you. I need you to survive. I won't harm you with words from my mouth. I love you. I need you to survive. I pray for you. You pray for me. I love you. I need you to survive. I, I won't harm you with words from my mouth. I love you. I need you to survive. It is his will, it is his will that, that every need be supplied. You are important to me. I need you to survive. You are important to me. You are important to me. I need you to survive. One more time, you are important to me. You are important to me. I need you to survive. There you go. That's the I, I know. I got no voice. I've been singing. I didn't know, been babe. You've been singing. That's why I didn't want to sing because I, I can't. You did great, babe. I've been Stop singing it. everything. Y'all, I've been leading everything, so my voice is gone. Thank you so much. Hey, Elaine, Simmons, and Mr. Joe, did you, did you rehearsal that together? That? Thank you so much, Elaine. How you doing? Elaine, I hope you're still here. Remember when you said it blacked out and you thought you were getting timed out? For some reason, Elaine, I don't know if our internet was acting up, but it was making it seem like we had ended the live. So I didn't want you to go. Me and Joe, we love to have you here. Excuse me. Don't ever leave, Elaine. We are always, you are always welcome here. Um, I think the inter our internet must have did a glitch and it made it seem like we were ending the video, but we we're still on. 
So please never feel like we want you away. You are always more than welcome. You have a wrench next to your name, Elaine. So as long as you got a wrench next to your name, you are more than welcome. And even if you don't have a wrench next to your name, you are always welcome to hang out and craft and chat and worship. That's what we're here to do, y'all. We love everybody, y'all. Thank you so much. Yes, 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 I love that song. We need to thank Lord for thanking you. Oh, thank you so much for the love, sweet tea. We love you too. Yes, 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 y'all. I don't know why I'm so dried out like that. I can't. You just gotta get hydrated, baby. You just gotta get a little hydrated. And then that I'll coffee, that coffee dries us too. Second. Yeah, we've been seeing. It's okay now. Everybody sing. Yeah. Stop me on the street. Hey, could you sing this song, sir? But if God give you that gift, you gotta do it. Do what you gotta do for God. God loves us. God loves a cheerful giver and cheerful singer. Now you just sing, you got an awesome gift right there. Am, but I'm, but still, right, right now. But I'm, now we got, we got to hydrate. We got to get. Up. I know you don't like to drink tea, but we got to do some type of warm things on the throat and lots of rest. Mm -hmm. And with us doing these long lives, it kind of messes with our voices as well. Um, and I have to stop screaming at the videos. Like everybody, what's up? I'm struggling. I have to I stop doing that. I, I have to learn to start started, talking lower. Well, I was good yeah. yesterday. I did all. I led every. And he song led every song. He did so good. But so. I've been. I've been. Uh, I don't know, I've been struggling since like last night to get words out. I, I sung on OVW's channel last night. I sung, uh, let's see. I can't remember what you on OVW's. I sung, uh, I don't even know if I can sing that right now. Did we sing together too on OVW's? No, yeah, I think you did, but I did, uh. We did too. We sung on OVW's. You sung by yourself and then we sung a song together. Yeah, you sure did. You sang a song over there by yourself, and then we sung together, too. We said we need each other. We are the church, and if our sister or brother is hurting, we need to be there for them. Don't struggle alone. Wow. Yes, Danny, you are so right. You said, Ms. Danny, Mr. Joe, so beautiful. Thank you so much. What yes, that's what happened, and the screen went totally back. Yes, Elaine. Yeah, we was not kicking you out or anything, Elaine. We want you uh, here. No, wait, wait. You are always welcome. Like I said, you're I always more than welcome. I can sing that on Lower Keto. Yes, we love us some Elaine. Look at Mimi. Yeah, that's what we signed. We signed it together. You been right now? Mimi's here. Hey, Mimi. We love you. How you doing? My voice has been going through in and out for a week. Really, Kelly? Yeah, I've been dealing with that, too. I've been dealing with, like, in and out. So I was like, I'm not bad. Because even at church, they're like, do you want me to pray? I usually be able to um, do that and go into singing. Because when I, some reason, when I get to prayer, like, you know, the Lord takes over and he just, like, so it's like. She's a powerhouse. And so I just, it's kind of hard for me to do powerhouse. both, y'all. So just don't know. You just don't know when you say one word and it encourages someone. Wow, you're so right, sweetie. How you doing over there, Mimi? What you working on over there? And sleep. Yes, Barbie, you're right. We gotta get some more. We gotta do. We gotta get some more sleep, man. You're so right. You said I think it was let go and let God. Yes, yes. It was let go and let God. Thank you so much, sis Sharita. Okay, and Barberson is another email. So I forgot about that. Barberson is another email of a picture. And you said I'm okay today, melancholy, but well, really melancholy. Okay, so what you got going on? You just relaxing a little bit? We love you so much, Mimi. I hope you've been getting your rest, too, because, you know, I know you love to support everybody and you love to do what you got to do because you are a great vlogger, vloggist, and you do a lot of things and you help your family and, you you know. But at the same time, you got to make sure you get some days for yourself, too, Mimi. You know, when you're not just running around and doing a lot, just try to take some days where you're taking it easy, too. Preserve some of yourself, too. I know you love to help, and I know you love to just do everything. <clears throat> I know that. I know that. But just remember that. Take some days a little bit to rest a little bit, too. There's nothing, it's nothing wrong with rest, and that's for any age, but it's nothing wrong with rest, me and me. So make sure you get those days, too, to rest a little bit. Thank you, love you, too. Didn't did your screen go back up, too? Yeah, it went black for, um, I'm not sure who, everybody went black, but it definitely went black um, for the Chit Chat Queen. She said it went, definitely went black for her. She was sitting there. And she was like, hold on, what happened? She left and came back again, and it was good. Hey, Mimi, are you okay? Yes. Boo hats tonight. So you got boo, you working on boo hats tonight? Okay. Are you knitting those, or are you doing those, are you crocheting them up? You said, okay, I think, what did it say? It was done by August. So I might just try to whip up a few of them for August. And I think I'm going to whip up some to send in, but I think I'm going to take some into the schools, too. Our son's uh, elementary school, I think I'm going to mix them up for them. No, but they realized one of the children had gotten on the internet, and that was what called. Yeah, that glitch. Yeah, Joseph. He was already. He was playing a game, and he ended up doing an online game. And we, it sucks up a lot of internet. Plus, I don't know if our daughter got her phone. Did you ever taking Elijah's phone off, Joseph? You taking Elijah's phone off? Oh, internet off our phone? 
It's never on. It went on. Oh, you turned the data off? It's been on. It is always on. You should turn it off now. Or should you, what's your only one of those long, night, night long calls or something? I don't know. You just turn it off so she shouldn't waste her data. She ain't gonna have no data. She ain't gonna unlimit it. You said, Lion Brand sent me an email that they received my 18 Blue S. What? All right, sweetie. Isn't that amazing that they sent you an email and let you know, hey, we got your box? Isn't that amazing? He said, I know, but I do what I can each day. I know. We love you too, Mimi, but I'm just saying, I'm not, you know, I'm not trying to tell you nothing to do, what to do, but I'm just want to say, you know, some days, hey, when you're running seven days a week, you got to put at least one or two days where you just kind of relax a little bit, you know, just so that way your body can, and it don't feel, it don't feel guilty about it either because you're always doing something. And I had to learn it myself. Like sometimes when you're always running and ripping and running, when you have a day or two to yourself, don't feel guilty about it. Just enjoy it as much as you can. If you want to use it to sleep, if you want to use it to flip the remote and watch TV, if you want to use it to look up, sit outside in the yard and lay down, and just enjoy it. And don't feel guilty. You said, my family likes it when I lose my voice. I can't talk so much. Uh-uh. <laughs> Chelsea, love. You said, we need to be careful to not let that spirit of defense build up in us. The devil wants us to be at each other's throats, but the Lord wants to be in our... Yes, there you go. He wants to be in one accord. You are so <clears throat> right. That, and you know he's a liar. He's a trickster. And he definitely will try to get us to be divided. He loves the vision. So, yeah, we got him. That's why I say I try to nip that in the bud. Hey, make sure, hey, everybody come here. Let's show some love to each other. And let's be about love and positiveness and supporting each other. I I want I want to make sure that, you know, when I'm gone and people remember me for positivity, don't remember me for, oh, I can't stand her. She was always rude. Or I can't stand Joe. His, he was, ugh. I, like, I want, you know. I'm not thinking about going yet, but I'm just saying I want to make sure while we're here it's positive and it's going. Okay, you said, ooh, ooh, I'm coming up on a decreasing road. All right. That's what I'm talking about. So, Kelly, how I can't remember. What did you say how big it was going to be? I love the decreasing. I love when you get to that point. <laughs> I love when you get to that point because, like, yes, I made it. Has anybody ever done C2C? I started doing C2C with OVW. She did a crochet along, and it was a love blanket by Marley Burr. I think it was called a heartthrob. And it was very, very fun, my first time. And I had to change colors going back and forth. And it was really, really amazing. I definitely want to do that again. I started one for myself with scrap yarn, and I just stopped it. And I got to get back to it, y'all. I got to get back to it. Okay, so Mimi says she's doing some both knit and crochet on her hats. That's awesome. If y'all haven't seen Mimi's, um, if y'all haven't seen Mimi's knitting skills, like, her crochet skills are off the chain, but I'm just saying her knitting skills amazing y'all she just got done with some socks <clears throat> for that yarn and zebra aka sis door beth and the socks were amazing y'all i mean the socks like she makes me want to knit socks i've never knitted anything but a little swatch in my life but she makes me want to knit well i didn't knit a hat and scarf but still that was like probably almost 18 years ago so anyways well no probably about 16 years ago but still i want to make those socks y'all me me the socks were amazing, y'all. I will put them on. I just want to wear them. I want to feel them on my feet. Oh, I'm sorry. They're just amazing. They're that good. You said, I have confidence in you, Kelly. Watch old Joe C2C scarf on the hat. Yeah, definitely, definitely. You definitely can do it. Oh, so I'm coming. Okay. Yes, keep it free. We got you. We got you. Hugs and loves, Kelly. Jesus' name. Yes. We need to keep Miss Tina in prayer, too. Yes, we do. Most definitely. We definitely keep her in prayer because my husband already knows he loves her. We both love her, and my husband would just automatically just feeling like she kind of maybe going to deal with some depression. And so, um, you know. Yeah, locked down that gipper. You know, so I think she was kind of going through a little depression, and we kind of cheered her up. We went and talked to her on the phone, and she called, and we just talked, and we laughed. We did a lot of laughing. And I know sometimes when you want to cry, um, it's best to try to find a way to get some laughter in, because I'm telling you, that's what I do. Sometimes when I have days where I'm feeling a little sad, I find I'm trying to find myself find, watching a comedy or, you know, doing something that I really love to do to get me some laughter in and, and confuse the enemy or pray, sing some gospel, whatever I got to do because that confuses the enemy. He might come in and try to get us all the little negative thoughts. Oh, you're not good enough. Oh, your bills need to be paid and you ain't got enough money for it. Or this is going to happen. Your car broke down. Aha, you can't go nowhere. Like he'll put that stuff in your head. You'll be like, oh my God, I got this to do. I got this to do. And that minute you start singing, praising, worshiping, being happy, Tricking him up. He's like, wow, I can't get to them? Hmm. I broke down their car. I burnt their daughter's face. You know what I'm saying? Like, I did this. I did that. What can I... I can't get to them? What's really going on? I can't get to them. You're telling me right now I can't get to them. They, they, what, what? 
So do what you got to do and infuse him. Don't let him get to you where you're feeling sad and down. It's easier said than done. But sometimes you just got to laugh at him and say, ha, ha, you can't win. And, and, and hang in there. That's the thing. It ain't easier said than done. Mm -hmm. As long as you got as long as Yeah, you I know. But I'm just saying, you know, sometimes you get piled. I'm saying that. If you if something kind of gets piled in on you, sometimes it feels like it's easier said than done. You know what I'm saying, man? Yeah, there you go. It feels like it. It feels easy. like it. It feels like And it, it, that's what I'm trying to say, baby. I'm, I know. I'm just not trying to. I'm just saying. You said last year in May, I had a two- put in my throat and I had scraped my throat and it had scraped my throat. I lost my voice hundred percent for a couple months. In the beginning, I thought I was going to get my voice back. You was not wild. You thought you was not going to get your voice back. Wow. So the enemy is in a land, but the battle belongs to the Lord, not us. There you go. You said that again. He said, I've been resting and relaxing today and tomorrow for sure. Just been very tearful on this anniversary. Oh, wow. Is it today your anniversary? I didn't, I remember. I know, I know your birthday. Today is your anniversary? Mimi was the 22nd. It was the day before ours. So it is, it's the 22nd. Yours is the, okay. I don't know why I was thinking it was 24. So it was the day before ours then. So happy anniversary as well. And I'm very sorry. I know it's kind of rough. I know. I can't remember Mimi's. I know Mimi's is close to ours, but I can't remember if it was the 24th or the 22nd. So it's 22nd then. And he said, Yes, you have to know how to treat people. Yes, you're right. Yes, Miss Cena's doing, she's doing a lot better. She's doing a lot better, but you know, she you knew how she was just feeling the other day. Mimi was just kind of going through and everything. Yes, love and hugs to Mimi. Said, I'm so sorry to the Lord. Her life today was not normal. Yeah, no, her life was a little, her life was different than normal. You say, You get so good when honey comes. Oh, thank you so much, Barbara. You say, I'm still not able to raise them. Oh, really? Does it hurt to raise your voice, Chelsea Love? Or is it just like, I don't know. How does it feel when you try to raise your voice? Say, so you're welcome, Mimi. I am sorry that I can't get around to everybody all the time. I love everybody. I know you do, Sweetie. Yes. Sweetie is amazing. I mean, Mimi is amazing. Sweetie, you are amazing as well, too. Yes, I've been catching Mimi. Mimi has been going live on Thursdays as well as Saturdays, and I've just been enjoying those days with her. Mama Swift's in the bit. Mama Swift, what you doing up, Mama Swift? Mama Swift up hanging out. How you doing, Mama Swift? Mama Swift say, hey, babe. I say, hello. How you doing? Mm -hmm. So I went to go see Joyce Meyer and my father's anniversary was coming up and she told a story how he could either choose to have a good day or certain anniversaries or we could choose to have a bad day from that day. Yep, you're right. You are so right. Yes, please continue. Yep, we sure got people lifted up for it. Yes, yes, yes. Just keep fighting. Yes, we just got to keep praying. Yeah, we just got to pray for her. So your anniversary of my hubby passing. Oh, it's a passing. I've been very tearful. Oh, oh bubbling like a faucet. I'm so sorry to hear that, Mimi. Yeah, I know what you're saying. Second year, that's, that's two years. You know, that's, that's always going to be rough. Hard. You, you're talking to the best friend here, you know? And uh, so, yeah, we'll keep you lifted up in prayer. Your birthday's coming up, you know? But we'll definitely keep you lifted up in prayer because I'm telling you, I never can understand. I can never <clears throat> imagine losing a best friend. So I'm definitely gonna pray for you. Well, you talking about you got a great friend, you know? Mm. How big is a rectangle I'm baby one? Honey. What is it? I did a square one. I gotta check it out and see. Yeah. And, uh, you make them big? Okay. When Jesus is my portion, I'm doing great, Mama Swift. Thanks for asking. Is he for the, I did a square one, Kelly, for mine. Man, it's 64 by 64. And it was a nice size. If you're talking about baby, baby, that wasn't bad. He was. 64 by 64 inches. Well, what's 64 by 64, babe? Huh? What's 64 by 64? No, I'm trying to figure out what's that what it is. I think it was it was a heartthrob blanket by Marley Bird. That was the one I did. It was a baby one, but it was nice. How you doing, Mama Sweet? You see you peachy? And 28 row now, 45 rows. Okay. 28 inches right now, 45 rows. Mm, let me see. 
You know what I'm saying? Love hard, grief hard. Ooh, wow. Wow, Barbara, you're right. And I know you oh, okay. are just Right, right, however long. Okay, just Lana, what did you, did you do? Marie did, you did the, um one by OVW, didn't you do that one? Did you do that love one that we did with OVW? How big was yours? The one you made for your mom, remember, Lana? Oh, so you start coughing, it feels like when you got go up a drink down the wrong pipe and you cough. Oh, really? Oh, my goodness. Oh, I know, I know. I was like, oh, oh, Mama Swift, you must, where you at, Mama Swift? There's a two, okay, you on the Cali side. You must be over in Cali. You just singing that, Mano just singing that. And I have been in there since. My name D and I have been here since she started her channel. Wow. I gotta change the key over to see that. So we have been there. Oh, that's amazing. Isn't that sweet to be able to be together like that? I just been here since September, but I didn't meet everybody. I don't know. I met some people from uh OBW. I met people from um uh, Granny. I met people from Miss Tina. And I met people from Sandy. Yeah, and that's how I met, mostly met everybody. And um, then I met people from yeah. different crochet groups. Yeah. Instagram. You I did a lot of that, too. You said, well, I need some more rows then. Oh, okay, bummer. Only 28 entries using that H hook. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. So, yeah, I did, Um, we did, what kind of hook do we use? I think we use a J hook. So I, turn, I turned it late. Oh, okay, what happened? That caused you to be upset. Oh, you turned in late? Hey, Cass. What happened to cause you to be upset? Oh, let's see. Mine was not blanket. But the baby. We were just talking about uh, my daughter. My daughter ended up um, burning her burning her face. She's doing a lot better now, though. She said, mine was a lap blanket, but baby, you should be about, yeah. Oh, 36 inches. Yeah, you're okay. There we go. There we go, Lana. Thank you. So they're going to try to get some rest. Okay, Teresa, sweet tea. We love you, and thank you for just being so sweet and being so helpful and amazing to us. We love you. God bless. Hugs and kisses, and and, and, and get some rest as well, too, because I know you're starting to feel better, but make sure that you, you know, do what you got to do. Oh, yeah, I forgot. We never do that. We never do the plate away, guys. I'll smell the trash and garbage. I'm like, what is in the world? <laughs> we never do the plate away, y'all. I can't take that no more. Okay, yes. He said, Kelly, 40 rows is good. You got this. Yeah, you got this, Kelly. Don't get discouraged. We did ours with a J-hook. The J-hook kind of worked up a little faster. He said, yes, it's been a fight, and then he, we're going to get her where she needs to, God. Yes, yes, yes. Yep. No, don't decrease, Kelly. It's fine. It's the width that you want. Oh, okay. Sweet T said, don't decrease it. Oh, he said... Don't increase. Oh, don't increase until you want it. Okay. Look at Sweet Tea. When Sweet Tea is ready to go, guess what you say? Hashtag keep calm and crochet on. Okay, Sweet Tea. We love you. God bless you. Sleep tight. Don't let the bed bugs bite. Thank you for hanging out with us. Y'all singing nice, live. Sweet yes, he was just singing. Joe just singing that. A little bit low, though. He was singing Sweet and Love. I'm doing that. No, I will keep my heart in my prayer in her Jesus' name. Yes, thank you so much. Yes, you got to. Yes, yep. It was really rough, man. I'm telling you, man, that it was rough. But she's doing so much better. She's doing a lot better now. Good night. I did. We showed pictures. You want to go back and watch the replay, man? Um, because we had her phone down here and we showed pictures of her swollen, like everything, her steps that she went through. Let's see. Oh, I'm so sorry, Danny. Oh, no problem, Cass. Later on, like after this is uploaded, come back and watch it, like like midway through or something like that, and then hear the whole story and see the pictures of how she's been doing, y'all. Y'all gonna see everything. Y'all gonna be like, what? You know? Said, okay, well, good night. Good night, Lana. Thank you for hanging out with us. We had an awesome day today. We had a whole day of just fun and laughter. So we appreciate you for being here, Lana. And good night. Sleep tight. Let, don't let the bed buzz by. Be blessed. We love you. And thank you for always supporting us. Okay, let's see. No, here. Oh, man. Okay, no matter. 
Well, good night, everyone. See you tomorrow. Okay. Everybody saying good night? Okay. Well, good night, Lana. Good night, sweet tea. Okay. Rosemary, if you're going to sleep, we love you. Good night. Or is everybody saying good night to Lana? Okay. So my knees are going to be raw when I get back down there. Well, your knees are going to be raw. Oh, really? When I can get back down there. Really? Oh, that is good news. Yes, thank you so much. Yes. Yes, I'll watch, watch your back. Yes, watch your back. Y'all going to see. I got to get my voice right. That's what you want to be hydrated. Let me be hydrated. Can I get a water? Here we go. Till I overflow. I want to run. I yeah, really you speak like Yes, thank you. Thank you so much, Daniel. We got to speak like We do. Okay, Kelly. You, and Kelly. Kelly, 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 Clumsy Mumsy. We're going to get y'all right. I got to get my son to do it, though, because every single time when we were talking about that, our son wasn't down here, and we never told him. It's a drawer. We still got batteries in that drawer, don't we? Yeah, we don't got... We, we got some batteries in that drawer, but... I think we still got batteries in that drawer. I think we got some batteries for it in that drawer. I'm sure we do. Okay, except for prank from praying. Oh, that's what you're saying. Okay, yes. Yes, we gotta we all gonna get on our knees and pray. We all need it. We all gotta keep each other covered, y'all. Yes. Yes, we do. I'm blessed. I'm gonna make you. What's that, honey? What's, what's you got on here? Seventy five? Almost I'm blessed to have a true prayer word in the house, isn't it? You right. And, uh, I'm blessed to have one. You a word. I appreciate you, honey. I appreciate the love. And for those who are not that, gifted in that area, ooh, yeah. prayer, prayer, you, you get, I mean, not saying anybody can say a prayer, yeah, yeah, yeah. but to be that powerful in that area. You think I am? Oh, yeah. So I'm working on this ear warmer, y'all. Turban ear warmer, guys. So y'all gonna be able to see this. This is what I'm finishing for tonight, y'all. That is the, that is the, um, that is what I'm doing for tonight's craft. Tonight's craft is turban ear warmer. In the color cherry, just my striped yarn from Red Heart. And I wish I would have had more red. I thought it you know who else would give me that feel like they just powerful. Who is that? Manda. Yeah, Manda. Yeah, she's a Manda. The prayer feel. word. She give me that feeling. Like Manda's a prayer word. Oh, oh, is she? I, yeah, didn't, I didn't know. I didn't, yeah, Manda's she's a prayer. give me that feel. Yeah, and Manda's a prayer word. Everybody, don't get me wrong, guys. Everybody can pray, but there's a, there's warriors and there are people who can pray. You know, give me that. Yeah, she got a prayer warm feeling. She give me that. Good God Almighty, make you jump out of your. Oh, you said you yeah. Make you jump out of your seat. Where we at, babe? Can you please tell me? Yeah, sir. I, I, I can't, can't see, see when you got no, something. This is it. 81. Okay. How many of the blues I had? 81 at? Six? minus 6 is 74. Okay, so I got to get 80. I got to get 83 rows. How many rows on the Addy you have done? I got, um. I got, well, I had 81, I got 82 now. But I gotta do, well, I got really 75 now. I gotta do 70, I got 75 on the color that I need. So I have to do, I gotta get to 80. Okay, sleep everyone, okay. Good night. Yeah. Oh yeah, get you some rest. Yeah, sleep yeah, tight. Sleep tight, Sister Sharita. Sleep, sleep, sleep Sister Sharita, say good night. Good night, good night. Good night, Sister Sharita. Sleep tight, we love you, God bless. Don't let the bed bugs bite and get some good rest. We love you, thank you for supporting. So how many rows on the Addy? I forgot okay. about that. I, I don't am, want to eat that pork because I'm already eating it. I know. Because I know. I would rebuke me if I'm talking crazy. I know. I'm just going to leave the bacon out, though. So, yeah, I'm almost done with this guy. I'm going to show you what I do next. I got to sew the ends together. After I get done with this, guys, I got to sew the ends together, twist them, and then get them all done. I can tell when, I, when my voice is gone, I see everything so high. Mm -hmm. so I'm kind of I'll settle it all. Save it a bit. Singing in your head voice. Mm -hmm. Is there a way? What I got, babe? What I got next for? How many rows I got? You're my friend. I'm sorry. What was it? 87. 87 minus. Six is 81. Okay. Strings like yours. Yeah. So I need 89? Huh? I need 89. Yeah. Strings like no other. Reach us to me. I just probably got it. In the fullness okay, of your grace. 90. I got too many. Yeah, one too many. Oh, okay. That's what I'm going to try to get to. 
in the power of your name. You lift me up. Alright, almost done, guys. You lift me up. In the so now I gotta add a little more weight on, guys, so I can show you exactly what I do. This is gonna be fun. It's gonna be cute, I think, y'all. So these just my stripes, y'all. Got these just my stripes, y'all. And I was like, what am I gonna do with these little bitty things? Was this a bad buy? I kind of got to. I'm like, you know, not th these are the ones my husband bought me, but I ordered some from Lion Brand. And I'm like, is this a good buy or what? What do I do with these? Is this enough even for a beanie? I think it may be just enough for a beanie, y'all. Why is it so dark? Well, I can put some in front of the camera. Look, babe. Wow, it is some crazy stuff. It got dark. Look. You're not even looking, honey. What? It's getting dark. Look. Oh, yeah, I see it a little bit. Why is that doing that? Are you doing something, Joseph? Because our son looking smiling. He be doing something. Because it's funny. Why is that funny? Our son, why is he laughing? Okay, he said, Zach, it's a knitting machine. Oh, Zach is here. Zach, what you doing? Thank you so much. Yeah, it's a knitting machine, Zach. Yeah, okay. So I'm looking forward to getting some hooks from you soon. Then he says she's looking forward. To... Okay, then he want to get some hooks. Okay, then. That's what Joe said was going to get you a hook, but I thought you said you wanted to make your own. Okay, so that's good. Then, yeah, Denny. Okay, let's see. Let's see. Now we got that, guys. Now I'm going to throw in some more waste yarn so I can show you what we do after that. Sorry, I'm still over reading comments. Are you reading comments, man? Yes. Okay, so now I'm going to throw some waste yarn in. Do Where a few that, rolls. Uh, that's where we go, Tico? She's gone. Oh. She said goodnight. I said goodnight, didn't I? I'm not sure right now. Did I say goodnight? You can say nice to anybody. Did I see somebody say, well? Oh. I don't think I'm trying to be rude because I wouldn't try to be rude. Uh, yeah. No man was just encouraging that mother. God bless you. Yeah. Okay, I ain't seen that. Well, if you, you do a question replay, you can always say goodnight to her now. Goodnight. Oh, you did say goodnight. You did say goodnight to her. Oh. Yeah, you yeah. did. You did say goodnight to her. You sure did. I said, big. Uh, since you really say goodnight, yeah, he said. Anybody make sure they when they put in when they put your name in it, always say babe. Such and such said this. To make sure. Because I know you're not a rude person. You like to show love. Okay. Oh, so, yeah, okay, yeah, I got you. Zach said I couldn't go to sleep, so I came back. I got you, Denise. I, I got you. So Zach, you gonna say you can't go to sleep, Zach? You were drinking that Coca-Cola, Zach. That Coca-Cola got you woke. <laughs> That's what I be doing. One night I drunk some. I didn't want to go to sleep, y'all. I wanted to craft. I'm gonna be honest. I drunk some Mountain Dew, and I was woke. Joe was knocked out because he wasn't really drinking any like that. So I just got to drinking it. I start crafting. I was up. I couldn't go to sleep. He's like, babe, it's time to go to sleep. I'm like, I'm on craft mode. What time is it there? I already, I already did it. Where at, man? What time is it there? Uh, that. I don't know where Zach is at. We just better find out now. He in Canada. Oh, Zach is in Canada. Yeah, he sure is in Canada. I forgot him in Atlanta. I think he's on the same time. He on the same time as us. What time is it? Hey Google, what time is it? In but it's different part. Oh, okay, there you go. I think Zach was about to tell us. He said, "Okay." Oh, okay. And y'all seeing his eyes on the spiral. No coke before bed. That's his mind. Ooh, <laughs> Zach said he can't do the coke. No more coke. Yeah, no more coke, Zach. Leave the coke alone, Zach. All forms of coke, none at all, Zach. No cokes. Well, I gotta go in the basement with that. Oh, you talking about Zyvon's Yeah, because I'm not. Yeah, Barbara won't hear it. It's 2.24 in the morning. Should I be? Oh, yeah, we're gonna say <laughs> Why should the shadows come in? Why should my heart feel lonely? And longer for heaven and home when Jesus is my portion, a constant friend is he, okay. his eyes on the sparrow. And I know he watches me. I sing because I'm happy. Y'all can't sing that right now, y'all. And boy. I sing because I'm free. I can't 
Hands in the rest. Hands are hands on. I was in the basement. My voice ain't. I ain't my the voice sparrow. Ain't. I gotta be in the basement, and I'm not good at singing. And I know in the bottom of the basement. He watches me, and I sing because I'm happy, and, and I, I sing because I'm free. Sing, I'm singing, John. You singing wrong key. Oh, Bust, bust me out on live. Can I just make you sound? Make you feel No, man. We'll you always got bust me out on live. It's not gonna sound like maybe something. Like just, just make it sound like I'm doing something. Just make me feel good. Maybe we were singing the weird. Make, make me feel good. It's gonna sound like I'm singing bad. No, it was sounding good. It was, it was doing good. It didn't sound good, bad. I like that sound. My ear didn't. That don't work in my I'm ear. Not, that's why I don't mess with him. I don't, I don't mess with him. Cheryl's in the building. Hey, Cheryl, what you gonna <clears> walk, girl? And I sing. Oh my goodness, we got more people up in here. I ain't see everybody. We got uh, Amsterdam. What's that called? Amsterling? Hey, Amsterling. So what's in Mountain Dew that keeps up you up? I'm scared of Mountain Dew. I'm free. That's your key. Oh. And I sing. Okay, yeah, I ain't gonna do that one. Anyways, I don't know what's in Mountain Dew, y'all. Yeah, I can't. I could do that. That's easy, easy for me, but I can't right now. Yeah, Mountain Dew is no joke. It rises on the sparrow. And I know he watches oh, I me. And I know he watches me. Oh, yeah, Kelly is Wisconsin with Kelly. Time he watches same time you got, Zach. Me. We got the same time. We doing great, Cheryl. How you doing? You got anything smaller? No color for me today. That's beautiful. Thank y'all so much. Yes, Sweet Tea loves red. You oh, are so sweet. Thank oh, you, you so much, Cass. You got one. You ain't gonna big. You said strictly water from now on. Oh yes, that. So yeah, this is what it came up to look like. Y'all better make this ear warmer. See how it comes up. Yep. Look at those shades in the middle, y'all. I like the way that worked up in the middle. Look at those shades. Thank you, Cass. I'll see yarn hard. You are too. Yes. Thank you for the love. Y'all are so sweet. Thank, thank you. Are, so thank now you. I gotta stitch this all together, y'all. I'm gonna single crochet this end together, and I'm gonna single crochet this end together, y'all. And I'm gonna show you where we go from there. Sterling wants to say hi from Puerto Rico. Oh, you in Puerto Rico, Puerto Rico. Hello. Puerto Rico. What time is it in Puerto Rico right now? How do you say it? Puerto, Puerto Rico? It's Puerto. So you. Caffeine is in Mount, is in Mount New. Yes, it is. It show sure is. It keep you up. You like. Boop, 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 Same as when the get right. Cha cha now, y'all. Let's go to work. That's what that Mount Dew make you do. Seriously. When Joe makes me some. He does, uh, he'll make me something like an usurper or something. And I'm telling you, it, it's that caffeine will be having you going crazy. What you want me to say with you, man? Great is your mercy towards me. Your loving kindness towards me. Your tender mercy I see day after day. Forever faithful towards me. You're always providing for me. Your gr great is your mercy towards me. Great is your great. Great is your grace. Wow, baby. <laughs> now I feel better now because she was busting me out. What's a Mountain Dew? Tons of caffeine. Yeah, Elaine. Yes, it has tons of Mountain Dew in there. Okay, clumsy, mumsy. I didn't know you were still here, clumsy, mumsy. Yeah, hey. we about to bring you in on a uh, what is it called? What's String guard. You gonna sing for us? Oh yes, Denny. Do you sing? Does Denny sing? Okay, let me see. What clumsy, mumsy wants a Denny, prayer. Do you sing? Mama, do you sing? It says, "Can you both lift my friend Lynn up in your prayer? She has been fighting cancer for." And the tumor has not responded to treatment for over two years of treatment. I'm so bored. Okay. Yes, we definitely will be praying clumsy money. We will be definitely praying for your friend Lynn. We'll be lifting up her lifting her up in prayer. And for everyone, every prayer warrior here, intercessory prayer, please let's lift up. Clumsy Mumsy's friend Lynn, guys. Let's lift her up in prayer, y'all. Come on, we can do this. Yes, the Lord gives you the word of encouragement. And peace and love and joy to speak to your friend here is the Lord is faithful and nothing is too difficult for him. You are so right. So Mana sings. Oh yeah, Mana got we gotta get Mana in here now. We want to get Mana in here then. Mana, you have to come in and sing with me. 
We're gonna have our own choir, YouTube choir. Oh, that'd be so crazy. We're gonna have our own YouTube choir. That'd be girl. crazy. You just, everybody got to study these songs every week. <laughs> that'd be nice. Yeah. It's an app that, that you can do that on too. It's the same song. I don't want that. Cass, also, y'all know how you are so lucky to have each other, guys. So much love between you. Mm. Cass, also, you might as well come and join the love train. Yes, you here too, Cass. You here too, Cass. Oh, yes, we're you part sure. of it too. We we're love part you too. Of family, yes. We love the family. You know, we <clears> all family here. This is our thing. We love to come here, hang out with everybody every night. That's what I'm gonna do, Denny. I'm gonna get her on stream or get her to sing with me. You too, Denny. Milo, get you too. Come on, get out. There ain't nobody nervous. Come on. Yeah, yeah. Let her know. Let her know, babe. Denny trying to play a little. No, I'm Denny. What song are we singing this week? We got to sing, um... I think Malik sent me some stuff today. I got songs I got to lead, too. I don't know All if you're going to do it. I hope we don't got to lead that. Next week, yeah. Why did I even mention that song? Next week, we're singing our songs. I don't even know why I mentioned that one song. Expect the great... Who are you kicking me? Expect the is on you. Oh, my goodness. I got yarn tangled up, y'all. We doing sold out, Lord your mighty way maker, have your way. Yeah, I don't know who's singing any of those songs, guys. I'm gonna be strip, really honest. <laughs> I'm gonna try to learn them. Cause I can't wait till I can. Yes, yes, yes. Caffeine, lots of you, so right. Hey, you said uh, don't miss anybody. Don't be trying to miss nobody. Okay, you said uh, okay. Drinking my first bottle of water for the day. Look at Zach. Zach been doing great. Zach, you are on a roll. Keep it going, Zach. Seriously, I'm not even. I'm just being really honest. Seriously, keep it going, Zach. You definitely can do this, Zach. You're not alone. Okay, guys. So I got to go in here, y'all. And I have to slip stitch these ends together, okay? I got to slip stitch my color of my hat or my air warmer. So these little colors, this blue, it doesn't, it's disregard. We disregard the blue. And we're going to slip stitch this all together. You can slip stitch it, single crochet it, whatever else. But I'm going to slip stitch it all together or probably single crochet it together. And then um, I'm going to show y'all how I turn it into an ear warmer. It's going to be beautiful. Y'all going to love it, y'all. Y'all going to love this technique. I don't know. I mean, I'm pretty sure ear warmer is going to come out good, too, because this color is nice. But I sure was worried about this. Y'all, like, how's it going to work up? But y'all know, I didn't see these little, see that little speckle? I didn't see that. And when it's crochet, it will look so different. That's why I wanted to get a knitting machine, y'all, because I like the way knit looks. And um, no offense to crochet. I love a crochet, but when it comes to certain ear warmers and hats, I'm telling you, it works up so pretty. Even a cow, all of that. Okay, Linda's here. What, Linda? Hello, how are you doing? I'm just joining. Didn't realize you were on in live. Yes, Linda, great to meet you. Um, I never, I don't think you ever came to our live before. I'm Dana. This is my husband, Joe. I know we see each other doing? all around the bend, and I've come to your videos and commented and showed you some love as well. But I'm so glad that you are here. Welcome in. We're just hanging out. I'm working on a turban ear warmer, getting it all done up. Worked on a central uh, knitting machine. I don't know if you have any knitting machines or anything like that. Kelly says, you know how great they are. How great. Yeah, we got, I think, then sings my song. Is that a song, ain't it? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think Joe's voice is a little bit out right now, and I definitely can't sing that at all. Well, we don't get, when Joe's voice gets back right, we're going to get it ready for you, Kelly. He said, Miss Ada, please try to use vitamin E drops and vitamin E cream for your daughter's face. Oh, okay. Thank you so much, Elaine. Thank you very much. I sure will. Okay, so you cut out soda completely. It's going to be hard. Yeah, but Zach, there you go. Take baby steps. Take baby steps because it's really good. Because water, every time you drink water, you get full. So you don't always get hungry. That's what's going to help you lose that weight too because you're like, ooh, this water got me full. Yeah, you got it, Zach. You can do it. Just slowly cut it out. You're going to have it. Don't get overwhelmed or anything like that because, you know, if you're like, oh, I, drank, I accidentally drank some pop today. I should have did that. Don't get yourself. Don't beat yourself up. Just drink it, you know, drink your water as much as possible. You know, there's sometimes where I don't want to drink pop, but there's sometimes I may drink pop, even though I don't want to. But there's sometimes I do if I'm if I'm eating a certain dish, and I just feel like I need pop to burp. You know, even though water can't help me burp, but I'm just saying sometimes I need a little pop to burp. Sometimes I do. I'm gonna be honest, even though I shouldn't do it, but I'm just saying. So yes, baby steps. Ask the Lord for help. Yes. So Linda, what do you got going on? You said I've been to your live before. Not sure if I saw you saw me. Oh, maybe I didn't see you there, or maybe I did. Did I ever comment or anything? I'm not sure. Did you lurk or did you say anything? I'm not sure. But I'm glad that you're here. No matter how, how many times you've been here, I'm just happy that you're here now. And I just wanted, I wanted to give you a, um, a, a formal greeting, just in case if I never did give you one before. 
That's what I want to do. I'm yeah. always like to give people formal greetings. But yeah, I'm working on this. Do you uh, do you have a knitting machine or anything? Or do you knitting anything, Linda? I'm just doing this on knitting machine because uh, <laughs> I want I'm, I'm doing a craft fair, Linda. A first time I ever did a huge thing like this, and I'm kind of nervous a bit, but I'm going to whip tons of things for it. I'm just kind of get my name out there more for the business side of things. Because once I started YouTubing and Instagramming, I put the business on the back side. Even though I still I still have a business and people still order, I didn't I don't I haven't been doing lots of advertising for the business. So this is going to help me get that advertisement out. I'm going to be doing pictures. I mean I'm going to be doing I'm going to get a banner. I want a banner with my logo on it, and um, I want new business cards. Okay, let's see what everybody's saying. That is, hey Linda, are you working on anything tonight? Yes, Elaine's asking that Linda work on anything. Yes, then the Lord will help me when I ask him. Yes, mother. Yes, yes. Oh, Zach, you said it took me a while to give up pop. I used to drink several liters a day. Did you? Yes, I'm telling you, Linda. I'm telling you, I know about the pop. I am right there with you. We love pop like that. Me and my husband would drink 20 ounces all the time. Two liters, 20 ounces all the time, y'all. And it was bad because we were couponing, y'all. Well, I can probably turn this this way now, y'all. I'm not. I can. Fa you can face me. I can see me again. Now. You still can see hubby too, though. I'm not. See, I didn't keep getting a corner. He was about to say that. You were. Uh, I am in a corner still. It don't matter. You were perfectly in the screen fine. You just turned it all the way around. Well, it was on the machine, babe. More. Oh. I put more on you. I'm sorry. No, no, no. You okay? You okay? I'm not talking anyway. You can talk, honey. I just I wanted to show my hands. I was about to slide down so they could see me uh, slip knot. That's what I'm saying, babe. No, yeah, you're fine. Okay. I thought you was going to see it. I know. No, I wanted to see my hands a little bit while I'm working a bit. <laughs> That's what I was trying to show them what I was doing so people can see. Because some people didn't see what I'm doing. It's hard for me to hold my hands up. That's what I was doing. I was struggling to hold my hands up showing them what I got going on. Okay, let me see what everybody's saying. Yes. And um, he said, I don't have a knitting machine. I, I still want to learn knit. Yes. I learned to knit from OVW at One Virtuous Woman. And she had some really great videos. She did like a fit to knit series. And I'm telling you, I learned so easily. And I fell in love with it. I did a swatch. And... Um, I had orders to do, so I had to take a break from it. But I got I got carried away with the knitting because it was so fun. I was gifted several knitting needles, never used them, and always was like, "Oh, am I ever going to use these?" Never threw them away though, and um, end up learning. I'm gonna I'm gonna do it though. I don't have any circular needles. Needles. <laughs> I don't have any circular needles though, so I got to get some so I can learn to make hats. I want to learn hats, and beanies, and um, hats, beanies, and socks. Except for me, I'm drinking four. 710 milliliter bottles a day. Really? Wow, Zach. That's awesome. No, it's not good. Oh, you're talking about pop? You're talking about water. Oh. Zach, really? Oh, my goodness. Oh, yeah, Zach. You got to slow down. I thought you was talking about pop. I mean, water, man. I thought he was talking about water, man. Yeah, that's not good. Baby's was like, that's not good. <laughs> yeah, Zach. Yeah, get, get on your water. You, it's, it's, you're doing it at the right time. You're still young. You're doing a great job. Kelly said, I also love the look of knit. I will get a new Addy. I will get an Addy. Yes. My son said he didn't. He didn't wear hats, but the came over wearing one. What? But he came over wearing one. He said that's different because I like, because the one he had was knitted. I, oh, my God. Okay. Kelly, my son did the same exact thing. I made him one. I don't have an Addy, Kelly. I have the cheap one. This is the um, Centro. S-E-N-T-R-O. It's about 50, 60 bucks. I have the biggest one. It's a 48 needle. Very, very good investment. Very, very good investment. Um, and like I said, you can see it here. Certain yarns, red hearts, certain red hearts do not work. I'm going to be honest. But every other yarn besides red heart is work, has worked good. I do have a red heart, like a little oatmeal or whatever, tweetish. I can't remember what color it's called, babe. Where's that one I got, babe? I don't know where it's at, but it's a tannish color, the oatmealish. With the little twiggles in it. I don't know what it's called, but I don't mind my wording. I said twiggles, but you know what I'm trying to say. I don't know where it's at because I pulled it out because I was going to work on it, make some ear warmers with it. It's a tannish kind of yellow, tannish color with little tweed in it. Here it goes. This is the one I want to make with Red Heart, and I'm praying the machine picks it up well. I'm praying that it doesn't do so bad because Red Heart is a thicker, worsted weight. And sometimes with that worsted weight on the on this central machine, it wants to act up. But every other one I've been working with, guys, it's been great. So, Kelly, if you don't want to get this, add, I don't know. I'm not saying you can't afford it. But for me, I just wanted to get something. I didn't want to break the bank. And that might break my bank if I don't use it all the time. 
and I don't use it all the time. So I figure I get this and it's really worth it. My son did the same thing. I made a knitted beanie and the man couldn't take it off. Okay. He was wearing it, taking pictures with it, having it all rolled up, thinking he was Rico Suave. I made him a crochet hat. It was in the corner with dust on it and lint. And he's over here smiling because he knows it's true. Okay, he said, I have a lot of knitting needles, circles, and trade. Really? Wow, Linda, you're doing great. He said, water will make you feel Oh, yes, that water will definitely make you feel better. Okay, Link, I just finished a virus shawl. What? Oh, my goodness, Divine had an X to his head. Oh, that sounds amazing. He said, I saw you making beanies a couple of lives ago. You inspired me to pull out mine. Really? I have a new beginner, but... I oh, yes, yes, it definitely... Kaz, it definitely helps with depression. Definitely. Crochet is a therapy. It has helped me with so much depression over the years and stress. I love to keep my yarn handy. Um, I'm telling you, I love to keep yarn handy. Anything, any type of craft, I love to keep it handy because it, I know I'm creating. I'm not letting depression or, you know, stress or anything get me to where I'm not doing anything. No, I'm going to be creative. What did I do? I hope I didn't mess up one of these. Cause I'm missing, I feel like I'm missing a stitch. Did I miss a stitch? Or was it an odd number? Oh, it might have been an odd number. Maybe do something in it. Or no. I don't know what I did. How about that right? Let me see. Okay. So I got all these. I, I stitched this all up, guys. I, sing, I slip stitched across. Okay. Let's see. I love watching Dana and John. Oh, thank you so much. You real people. Oh, thank you so much, Cass. Cass is... Cass said, love watching us. We're real people. Well, thank you so much. Appreciate it. Thank you, Cass. We appreciate you being here. Always showing some love. He said, Linda, and that's why I'm coming to visit you. I know. Linda has everything. I, Linda, Linda is working up and making some beautiful items. I knit three scarves many years ago, but only with a knit stitch. Okay, you can't pearl to save a lot. Yes, that pearl is kind of tricky a little bit. And then I just learned how to pearl with, um, what did I learn to pearl with, babe? Tunisian crochet. Lana from Just Frog that taught me to pearl. Tunisian crochet. So I know how to pearl with Tunisian and I know how to pearl with knitting. But I'm telling you, I don't like to do I don't like to do the um I don't like to pearl. I'd rather do knitting if I can. You haven't seen it. Beautiful yarn barn. Linda, have you seen your beautiful yarn barn? Y'all, I can ten quarts of Oh my goodness, Linda, please. Okay, are you doing Zach is good night? Okay, good night, Zach. We love you. God bless. Sleep tight. Um, Linda, what are you doing to can? Oh my goodness. Linda, do you have any videos on your canning? Because I know it's gonna be too hard to explain it right now. But did you do a video about it or anything, Linda? I'm wanting to can. I have a pressure cooker and I'm wanting to use it to do some canning. Because my husband always does a garden and my mother in law's so and we always do tomatoes and we love our stewed tomatoes and our diced tomatoes. But we don't like fresh. My husband does not eat fresh tomatoes. And I want to can them. As well as, what else can we can, babe? There's something else we can can. Can it? Is there something else we want to do? Peppers? No, not peppers. You said what? Did you say something explicit? I don't think so. Oh, I don't you think don't so. No, he doesn't talk explicit. Let's see. Why Danny tweet? Okay, yes. Linda, you are busy today. Woohoo! Yes, Joe, wake up! Look, everybody trying to get Joe to wake up. Listen, Linda, oh, that I wonderful. Work. I don't I ain't sleep. I was ready to talk. You said I was, Denny. I've been since six in the morning after pulling the beets from the garden, painting them and canning them. I'm tired. Ooh, I like knitting. Sometimes I will knit in the brim of a crochet and the rest of that. Ooh, I love that look of that. No, I was just while you was reading or not saying, and I was just. Well, Just keeping it going. Talk. You were talking already. I was letting okay. you talk. Do you want to talk or anything? No, go ahead. You got the floor? Yeah, go ahead. I want you to talk. I'm trying you to, to save my throat a little bit. Mm -hmm. Ain't nothing to say. Okay. You didn't talk. You didn't say that Well, I was talking about the hat. I'm not talking about nothing else. I'm just talking about this craft. Why you, you know, if you want to talk about whatever, it's talking about. Okay, go ahead. I'm okay. okay. I'm just talking about the craft and keeping it going. What do you want to talk about, babe? Nothing. You want to talk about anniversary or you want to wait till tomorrow for that? No, what do you do Why are you not talking? Are you sitting or no? That's it. I'm just sitting um, here. <laughs> I'm fine. Joe, you too much. I I don't have any videos on canning. I only use a pressure cooker 
to to can green beans. I use a water bath canner for everything. Else. Oh, is it a is that a water bath canner? Is that like something you buy, or are you saying that you do it on the stove with like a pot and a water bath around your cans or your jars? Or you put them in mason jars, Linda? I'm sorry, I'm, I know you just got in here and I'm bum rushing you with all these questions. But me and my husband wanted to can for a long time, haven't we, babe? Mm -hmm. We have been talking about canning for a while, and I have been really wanting to do that. Because what did we say we wanted to can, babe? I'm trying to remember. Do you remember what we were talking about canning? We said we wanted to can tomatoes. Mm -hmm. Is that it? Tomatoes, bro. Okay. That's the only thing I can think of. Okay. I can't remember. I accidentally pulled this out, and I'm so mad at myself. I accidentally pulled this. I call the machine. I'm praying that it doesn't come loose. Let me see what everybody's saying. Sorry, guys. Did you pull it out with no scissors again? Uh, no. It's got snagged on this thing. Mm -hmm. I, was, I was pulling it out. Since I'm under it, I couldn't see that it was a piece. It was one oh. that was still on the needle, and I didn't know it, and I was pulling it out, mm -hmm. and it was caught. And it, it just got snagged on one end. It didn't get snagged on the whole thing. Oh, yeah, it good. was just like this one end right here got snagged. See how it came down here? Yeah. It's that's like, good. Yeah. The rest of it is good. It just got unraveled right on. See that right there? Right there on all that got snagged. Oh, wow. See, all this is still pretty much in place, see? Yes, yeah. That's true. I'm like, what? That's one thing about this machine, though. You got to be careful. Let's see what everybody's saying. Okay, I'm sorry. I've been crocheting for 46 years. Wow, Linda. My mama taught me when I was seven, and I'll be 53 in July 11th. Wow, we got all these birthdays that are coming up. Wow. Yes, I've been crocheting myself for 38 years. Yeah, Joe's been crocheting for 38 years, so and he's 35. So that's really good when you can crochet before you're even born. Mm -hmm. I love that. And um, Mimi's birthday is July 13th. My six-year-old, our son's Jason, his birthday is July 12th. And Linda's birthday is July 11th. Isn't that amazing? My sister loves canning stuff. Oh, my goodness. Really? Mmm. Thank you so much, just love. All right, Chrissy, good night. We love you. God bless. Sleep tight. Enjoy your anniversary day, Joe. Good night, everyone. We love you all. Sleep tight, Chrissy. I find recipes on how to on pay. Oh, okay. Thank you so much, Chelsea Love. You said, oh, my goodness, Miss Aunt Linda. I can't imagine the wonderful things you have made it over the years. I know. Isn't that amazing, Elaine? <laughs> Denny said, what's going on with your hat? I retired it. Mm. Oh, okay, Linda, thank you. Yes, Joe was crocheting with Jesus before he was born. You're right. Because mm -hmm. he went to Calvary and he saved the rest like you and me. Oh, that's your birthday too, Shonda? Wow, that's amazing. Look at everybody got the same. July is a very popular year. Yeah. <laughs> I'm sorry, guys. I'm sleepy. Mm -hmm. when, it, when it gets past three hours, guys, I get very tired. Mm -hmm. I say a lot of crazy things. I just said July is a very popular year and I'm in the same month. And my son heard him bust me out. He haven't been participating in any of the live shows, live vids, but when I make a mistake, he's going to be there to correct. Just like his father. I ain't saying nothing. I can't, you can't get a word in right here. We love you too, Mimi. Sleep tight. I'm just talking about this. You're not saying anything. I don't want to leave it dead. I don't want to say something you start talking over me. I wasn't trying to talk over you, babe. I didn't know I wasn't doing that. I was trying to keep it going because I don't want to. I don't want me to. Me gone already? Yeah. I'm about to be. I'm about to go and join me. Okay. You said my mom Kelly you still woke? My mom's the fifth, 
stepmother was a fifth. Wow, uncle seventh, dad was tenth, daughter sixteenth, sister twenty fifth, second stepmom twenty eighth. What? Wow, yeah. First Amy Pink Kelly back already? Yes. I don't know she went to sleep. Me too. I sure thought she went to sleep. Me too. Okay, we love you too, Mimi. Good night. Sleep tight. Sleep tight, Mimi. Love you. Alright. Now that I got that done, all I gotta do is just pull this blue out. It's mm -hmm. called waste yarn, because I'm not I don't care about wasting it. <laughs> what y'all eat for dinner? I'm having something simple tonight. Very simple. I went all the way around the world and come to a cheeseburger. Here's my conclusion. Let's see. Am I saying that? Oh, you say you've been here, just cleaning and listening. Oh, you're just listening? You say you're just listening and crocheting. Oh, okay. Yeah, Kelly never went nowhere. Oh, I thought she said she was going to sleep. You said July is a busy month. Mine is 11th. My son's 24th. Daughter is 27th. Why it is? And I've only got one son in July. Yeah. But we got a lot of family members in July too, though. Don't we? Yeah, mom and Ruby. Hmm. My mom and Ruby. Yep. Son. Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I forgot that's that. <laughs> I mean, is that it? Oh, we got a couple. We got a niece in July too. Who's that? Maya. Um, she will be six this year. That's what everybody's saying. You said I have Arby's Gyro with a chocolate shake. Lord Jesus. That sounds delicious. Who had that? Of course, I mean. Yes, yeah, Kelly. You send me a shake in the mail. Mm, 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 mm. <laughs> oh my goodness. Clumsy Mumsy's birthday is July 9th. Really? Everybody's birthdays are coming up. What is going on here? I'm so happy to hear that. Yeah, okay, I know why everybody's working now. Awesome, awesome, awesome. We gotta have birthday parties. Yeah, we need to start doing that. You wanna start doing that? Mm hmm. Okay. Linda's. Where is Linda? How's her, what's her channel? I know she got a channel. Linda's. Is it Linda's Yarn Barn? That's what I thought it was. Linda's Yarn Barn. And Shonda. It's July 11th. Mimi. July 13th. Who worked this night? Who just said that? Clumsy Mumsy's the night. Mm -hmm. It's the night. Who else? Who else? If you if you do if I do doors, who needs to meet Miss Tina? Yes, yes. Her camera, her channel is Crash by the Rose. Yes, Elaine. And she usually will be here too, but I know it's late. She, I think she's been getting her some rest lately. And she does do some beautiful doilies. You are so right, Elaine. I love her doilies. I'm not really her good. Birthday at coming too, man. Miss Tina's birthday's coming up, y'all. July seventeenth. My birthday is in two days. So your daughter will be 30 years old. What? Oh, my goodness. So do you both like oatmeal cookies with walnuts? Oh, my goodness. I definitely do. Um, I don't know if you ever hate cookies with walnuts. Have you ever had walnuts, man? No. I don't like he doesn't do the walnuts, but I definitely love them with walnuts. Clumsy Mumsy. He said, thanks. Yes. He said, that's, yes, that shake was amazing. Oh, hit the spot. I know it did, Kelly. Oh, that sounds amazing right now. That sounds so good. The shake and the oatmeal cookies with the walnuts. That sounds amazing. I like to make a delicious wall. Uh, uh, what kind of oatmeal cookies do I like to make, babe? With a, with a delicious icing on top? Oh, man, that is a long time. Mm -hmm. I'm craving sweets right now, guys. I know, me too. I haven't had any sweets in a long time. I'm babe, not... look, at it, look at it. Okay, oh, that's nice. Dark. That's what we got so far, guys. Can somebody go and get me a, uh, a nice uh, piece of chocolate cake or 
Yeah. Yeah. Elephant ear or banana pudding. Mm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, that sounds good. Are those my specialties? What are you saying? I see about what Noah says. Huh? Yeah, I'm trying to see if somebody can go get me one right quick. Uh, like when Benny Bus said that, oh, I gotta find somebody make me a uh, cake or banana pie or mm -hmm. somebody said he want. He said, Joe's sleeping on a job. <laughs> what is your favorite cookie? I'm sleeping. I'm wide awake. I don't go to sleep early, y'all. That's one thing I don't do. I go to sleep pretty pretty late. I gotta check out your door at least too, Linda. What's your favorite cookie, babe? As long as you want to know what our favorite cookies are. Uh, my favorite cookie is. Snickerdoodle. Okay. But it's a certain kind. What kind is it? Your recipe uses it, but... But what? I don't see them often. Hmm? I don't see them often. You don't see them often? I don't know. I'm going to call it out to our anniversary. That's what I'm I think my favorite cookie is going to be chocolate chip. I think that's my favorite. No, I got to show love. But it's a certain kind. That's all I'm saying. I was making a joke, but it's a certain kind. I don't like just... Any Snickerdoodle. Yeah, do you like the traditional one? No, nah, I like yours because they got that little chew to them. Like <laughs> you like that. a chewy cookie? Yeah, I don't like it. Everyone ain't like that. They got like that little weird little cookie taste. <laughs> They're like a little cake cookie. <laughs> I don't one. like that taste. Is it more cake cookie-ish? Yeah, I don't like that. I like yours because it's, it's actually a great recipe. Mm-hmm. Love that recipe. Oh, my goodness. And nice that she had KFC chicken pot pie. It was delicious. That sounds good. And Snickerdoodles are seasonal. Yes, they are. Miss Elaine, could you send me some of your papa? I'm hungry, too. i just take one bite. And I'll send it back. What? Oh, nah. I'm going to use my own spoon. <laughs> oh, my gosh. <laughs> How did you know she wanted it back if you ate it? I ain't bored with Miss Elaine. I seen. <laughs> Danny, what you cook? I know you didn't cook. You love tea cake. See, mine that said she's going to... No, that was not mine that said she going to send me a recipe. That was a... Uh, that was a... Uh, Latoya says she wants to I bet Monica can cook. Oh, yeah. Monica definitely can cook. Danny, what you cook? I know you didn't cook something that we can eat. Danny, what you cook? You ain't, you ain't frying no chicken or nothing? Mashed potatoes or nothing? Potatoes or nothing? I got, I'm, I'm having a lazy night, y'all. I don't feel like... I was going to make us breakfast right quick, but... I haven't drunk enough water. You want to do it tomorrow? Yeah, I'm going to do it tomorrow. You can all just work on it together as family. My kids are supposed to make it for me. I guess I'm going to get that. They probably do it tomorrow. I ain't got nothing to do tomorrow. Tomorrow's gonna be a perfect day for her. Yes, it do with like banana pudding. And she makes one of the craziest ones. Lord, have mercy. <laughs> I can taste it right now. I'm crazy. I'm gonna do a soda together, guys. And we're gonna see what's gonna happen with this ear warmer. Okay, let's see what everybody's saying. What's just love saying? Are you not inventing the other chat thing? Mm -mm. So, my favorite cookie is when they are out. Out of the oven. Oh, yes. So it could be any cookie. You're just talking about as long as out of the oven. Then you make grilled cheese. Well, can you put a hamburger patty in mine? Wow. I like my grilled cheese with a hamburger patty in it. Guess it got quiet in here. <laughs> Every time I talk, talking, it gets quiet in here. Chit chat, queen. Is that queen still here? You said I have to know how to. You said I have to know how to cook. I got a countryman. Oh, you got your countryman. Oh yeah, that's a cheeseburger. <laughs> exactly, chit chat queen. That's exactly what we're talking about. He wants cheeseburger. Okay, good night, Kelly. We love you. Good night. Sleep tight. Kelly saying good night, babe. Good night, Kelly. Said, Everybody, sweet dreams, blessings. Good night, sweet dreams, blessings, prayers. Yep, that's love what you, it love is. Kisses. It's a grilled cheeseburger thingy. With mm -hmm. mustard, ketchup, and pickle, and bacon on it. Oh, boy. That all sounds delicious. Maybe a slice of the grilled onion. Oh, boy. That's what I'm going to go ahead and make myself tonight. I'm going to make me a... Can you make me one? one? Huh? Can you make me one? A couple dollars. That, that's what I want on my grilled cheese. That's what I like on my grilled cheese. I don't know about y'all. Mine says she make birds that she can eat a whole one. What? Why didn't you be doing like that? <laughs> no, no, Chit Chat Queen. That's a grilled cheese with the works. <laughs> so when you go, next time you go to Five Guys, say, can I get a grilled cheese with the works? They say, what's that? 
I want a grilled cheese with a hamburger patty on it, some bacon, mustard and ketchup, pickle and bacon. Oh, I said bacon. I said bacon twice, didn't I? That must mean mm -hmm. I like stitch. bacon. Yeah, we like bacon. That's all. Mm. No, I'm just a stitch, baby. I thought I did too. I hate when I do that. I was trying to be quiet. I was trying to be quiet. I was letting my wife talk. And then y'all said I was quiet. Y'all said I was sleepy. You sleepy, Joe. You not. You doing this. You doing that. Now that I'm talking, I'm talking too much. Jeez. Can't satisfy, did he? Look at what you got right saying. That sounds so good, though, y'all. He said, wait. <laughs> what was that? A good night, Kelly. A good night, Kelly he said, I need to go to bed too. More beat pickles tomorrow. Okay, well, Linda, we, we appreciate you for being here. Thank you so much. Good night. Good you slip, rest. Who? That was Linda. Oh. She so need to go to sleep too. Good night, Linda. We appreciate you for hanging out with us. It was a great time. I know it's late. He said, oh, we, Yeah, we got Joe going out. Yes, y'all do. Y'all got Joe going. So they're going to come put us out with no grilled cheese. <laughs> yes, they I know is. I'm hungry too. We haven't even They're they going to tell y'all, they're going to say, they all you have to do is say, I want a grilled cheese with that, and they don't give it to you. Hook you up. That sounds too good. I'm starving. I haven't eaten no food today, y'all. Did I eat any food today? I didn't eat no food today. Did I? I didn't either. I understand. We didn't eat no food today, did we? Uh-uh. Do it for real. I'm just <laughs> I'm saying do we eat you, you didn't, oh. but I did. Oh yeah, he did. I didn't eat no food. I ate some animal crackers at home, but that's nothing. I ate some food. Gracie gonna sleep? Grace? I ate the rest of my food from last night, y'all. I had a fat ribeye steak. Tow it up. Oh, good night, Gracie. I didn't know you was even here, Gracie. Gracie was good night, Gracie. Gracie was in here lurking. We love you, Gracie. Sleep tight. Thank you for coming in. You've been I have to go to bed. Okay, well, good night. Prayers for your daughter's family. Thank you so much, Gracie. Well, Gracie came in. Thank you. I'm about to go Sleep in tight. here. Sleep tight. Don't let the bed bugs like my mom my hugs. Wash me a, a big potato off mm -hmm. and put it in the oven right quick, and that's what I'm going to eat. This but you going to feed me, too? Huh? You not going to feed me? <laughs> no, I can say me though. I can say us. Cause I'm getting worried. Make sure you, I don't wanna. I make sure you gonna hook me. Gonna hook me. <laughs> don't forget about the girl. <laughs> don't forget about the get. I didn't know you like. Ah, uh... <laughs> oh, see, that's, that's messed up. You know, like what? I know you like burgers. He says Linda says two o five a.m. here in Oklahoma. Oh yeah, so that means three o five here, Linda. Three o five here. Oh my goodness. And she just says you hungry too. She said, Mr. Joe, go and whip up us some banana pudding. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, Denny, five guys is expensive. Yes, I usually do the I usually do the banana pudding Elaine, so I gotta get together. I gotta go get the stuff for it. we got our car is we don't got a way to get around so so hard. Look at Lane said, Yeah, we want banana pudding. That sounds delicious, don't you know? <laughs> I always take a burger and fries. Oh, Lord Jesus. Everybody going in right now. What's going on? She Jack Queen said she want burger and fries. I know. That sounds good. But I'm, I'm going to make this baked potato with it. I got some grilled onions. I oh, grew it off last night. Yeah. You see what Shana said? I don't know. I see that. I think that's a good idea. Yeah. Once a month birthday party and have song requests. That's be good. Wow. That's great, Shana. Thank you so much for that idea. Any sweet tea? Oh my goodness! Look at Chip Jack talking about we got any sweet tea. Oh my goodness! And then he wants to get it. <laughs> yeah, he do, don't he? He said, "I know that's right." Chip Jack Queen, Mr. Joe, making us hungry. I know. Talking about him, like he gonna make me none. I'm gonna do him like that. You what? Act like he gonna feed me. <laughs> okay, so here we go, guys. Let me show you what I got. I need to weave in this end. Hold on, let me weave in a small end right quick so I can show you. Yes, if I don't make her nuts, she's going to be looking at my food anyways. Exactly. I mean, so, so, mm. I'm going to be definitely looking at his food because he, I'm supposed to have some. Yeah, I thought I was going to. I'm saying, go look it up for a I'm just saying, you didn't want to mention that you was going to make it. I might as well let you do it. <laughs> he good. mentioned it. I'm not gonna, should I, okay, if he mentioned it, should I just let him make it or no? You already had the idea, so you already know it's you. You know what I'm saying? You already got the taste for it, so you know how it's gonna be. That's okay. I, I decided I want this no <laughs> Come on, man, I'm doing that. Come on, hook it up for it. I'm wow, that's messed up. How you gonna do me like that? You know I'm hungry. Me too. I'm hungry. I'm hungry too. I'm gonna try to get work done now. I'm gonna hurt my back. Oh, okay. I'm getting caught out again online, y'all. That's how you do. 
Okay, let's yeah. see what everybody's saying. He's like, good night, Miss Linda. Okay, put your link in the chat so we can visit your channel. Oh, thank you so much, Elaine. That's so sweet. You might have, oh, somebody else might have put it up, though. You said, Dana and Joe love this line. Oh, we appreciate y'all. Okay, yeah, only mods can add links. Okay. Does anybody want to put uh, Linda's link up? Babe, can you put Linda's link up? Linda, uh, uh, yarn barn. All right, guys, I just got done sewing those ends in, weaving them in, guys. So let me show y'all what it looks like. Y'all ready to see this? Are y'all ready to see this masterpiece? I wish I had a little mannequin to put it on. Y'all ready? Do, 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 do. Pow. This is a turban ear warmer, guys. This is the back, which is doling. And then this is the front. For anybody who loves to keep little cute little ear warmers on when that winter time comes, very stylish. You can put your hair in a bun and have this around your head. You can have your hair down and just put this on top. If you go to the website, you'll see my daughter wearing one. It's in a mustard color. And she is rocking it, y'all. She's rocking it. So I will be whipping several of these up, guys. I'm going to be whipping these up. What do y'all think? What do you guys think? Okay, yes. Super, super cute. Look at that, y'all. I'm very pleased with this yarn. I am very pleased with it, y'all. Okay, yep. So... We got links up here. This is um, Joe put up Linda's link as well as Denny did. Okay. Yes, and I made it fast, guys. This is super easy, super quick. If you get one of these knitting machines, y'all just want to do some crafts. Y'all want to just make it up. It doesn't take a lot of experience, you know. It'll look like it'll look like you take a lot of experience, but it doesn't, you know. He said we all snack. I know, yes, ma'am. So I'm gonna be making up some more, guys. I'm gonna be doing the next one. In this color, wild blueberry, y'all. Because I want to get it done. I think this is going to be cute. I made this with 83 rows. And it doesn't look like it's, uh, you know, big, but it stretches beautifully. That's the good thing about knitting, y'all. It stretches beautifully. So I'm going to be making a lot of these up and selling these. Like you all know, I am a YouTuber. I am an Instagrammer. But I am a businesswoman as well. So, uh, you're so welcome. So welcome. Linda, we will definitely check you out. Everybody check out Linda. Go to her channel, guys. Be a part of her family. If you do have a channel, she'll be part of yours as well. She'll be a part of your family. Linda, um, if you've never came here before at all, uh, just no, letting you know, I love to support people. I'm all about people dropping their links, being able to drop links. If you come back all the time, you will be a moderator. Um, if you, I don't know, I'm not saying you have to come back because I know our schedules are crazy. But I'm all about supporting people. If you say you need watch hours, I have a watch hour group that we watch each other's watch hours, our playlists. Every week and help you get your watch hours up. Uh, if you need more family members, I'm good at have, letting people come over to your channel and, you know, people that you don't have or whatever, introducing you to people. I'm all about support. So just know that I'm very super loving on that. <laughs> Joe got lightning fingers. <laughs> Thank you so much, Linda. I appreciate the love. Super excited. Like I said, I'm going to make it one in this color as well. I'm just I'm having fun with these. I'm bringing out my knitting machine again, guys. And these are super warm. Um, no offense to crochet, but since these are double thickness, they're very, very warm. And so these are really good for those blizzardy days. You know, some of those days we're sitting outside or waiting for going outside, going to the car, waiting for the car to warm up, waiting for the bus. Whatever we do, like my daughter, she rides the bus to school. So these are really good for her. She keeps warm beautifully with these on. And I'm, I can't get enough of looking at this beautiful spotted, speckled yarn. I love the way it looks. Okay, so good night, Linda. We appreciate you. <laughs> we love you too. Sleep tight and let the bed bugs bite be blessed. And thank you for hanging out again with us. We had an awesome, awesome time. Linda, say good night, baby. Good night, Linda. Have a blessed night. Okay, so honey, is we ready to get off now? Yeah, yeah whenever you're ready, baby. Okay, so I'm time we at 338. So ready? Yeah, we're probably in. Okay, guys. Because I'm going to go and get ready to make us something. No, go yeah. Okay, guys. So we're going to go ahead and head out as well, guys. Um, Just because we've got to go get something to eat. And we kind of went over a little bit longer than what we were going to be on, so. But we had a great time, always. always. We got this, we got, so, I put the title as Turbo Ear Warmer, so. <laughs> Whoever watches this, they can know that we did get some work done tonight. Mm -hmm. We did chat, we had a good time. We got to show y'all some appetizing food, and um, we got to sing some great songs of worship. So, we love you all. Thank you so much. I do the, I do like the color of that yarn. It's very pretty. Thank you so much, Chelsea Love. I'm excited about trying this one, too, so. I got a whole bunch of different ones. I don't know how many I got of these, but I got a nice amount. So I'm going to make them all in this. You can. Yep, and just have a ball. Okay, we love y'all. Good night, Shonda. Good night, Chit Chat. We love you too. As well as, thank you so much, Rosemary. Thank you so much. God be with you all until we meet again. Yes, 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 Mana. God be with you too. And until we meet again, we love you all. Mr. Joe, give us some more cooking. Oh, yes, we got some more cooking coming, y'all. 
cooking is coming very very soon guys so you got some more videos you gotta get them edited and uploaded we love you all good night you said that food was trash ah <laughs> Mine is in the food with trash. Okay, it's good pleasure. It's in the trash now. Yeah, it's in the trash now, y'all. <laughs> Denny, good night. We love you too. Good night, Rosemary. Yes, good night, Elaine. We love you too. Yes, yes, yes. Sleep tight, Chelsea Love. Good night. We love you all. Happy anniversary. Thank you so much, Rosemary. Thank you so much. Tomorrow we have an anniversary party, y'all. Have a little fun. Do some little anniversary games. And just have some fun. So I guess we're we done, all right? Yeah, we are done. All right. Love you all. Gonna sit we by have everybody. Have a blessed night, everybody. Mm -hmm. We love y'all. Thank you so much, Denny. Have a blessed night. Good night.